All right, guys, we're live. Dune Spice Wars um, here with Hadrian and Pone in chat, and uh, we got our first match going. So we're going to play this, and uh, of course, we'll probably do three or four games today. So fear not, you guys will get a chance to join up, and uh, I think we're all good, yeah? I hope I win. Yeah. Yep. We're going to spice up your life. That's right. Dude, the Atreides are going to die in the dark, dude. Oh, I get to see all the movie lines now that you're playing Atreides. It's perfect. It's everything that chat wanted. <laughs> Just you getting nuked. If I start losing... Over this, and over. If I start uh. yeah, if I start losing and somebody's going to be a clear winner and we can't stop them, I'll, I'll try and whip out a nuke for you guys. But um, yeah, here we go. We know that won't happen. You're always in the running. Uh, Harkonnens are interesting. I always feel like I'm rich, but I have trouble like... Yeah, I mean, they can play politics, but I think Harkonnen's big strength is late game military and the um, intel, right? Because they, they get like a ton of intel by sacrificing wow, brainwashed agents. <laughs> Instantly, everybody nuke pwn. Well, it's a tradition nuke here, pwn. dude. It's a tradition. What they want. Wipe People him want from the face of the galaxy. <laughs> Destroy him. Kill them all. Dude, what, one of my favorite Star Wars lines is uh, Darth Bane when he's like, wipe this pathetic planet from the face of the galaxy. <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty heavy metal, dude. Uh, no, this isn't the tournament. Um, we already concluded the first round of the tournament. I posted my game as Carino. Um, we're playing the grand finals on Saturday, Saturday night probably, which I'll record and then I'll upload that as a video. Um, so currently the grand finals are me, uh, Hadris, uh, Faisal, and also Davok from our community. So we have our top four for the uh, grand final. So, all right, let's, uh, let's pause for a sec, make sure everybody's loaded in. Wow. Just ruined my whole strat. No, no, you got wrecked, dude. Get get outplayed. All right, perfect. So let's take I a look. All pause. right, I'm on the east side. We, uh, I'm still waiting for a server. You are? We can always remake if you have any issues, so don't stress oh, it. Oh, man, Hadrian's dropped. That sucks. Better luck next year. No, um, he should load in. <laughs> no, no, I'm loading in. It's just sometimes it's uh, faster. They really need to make it so you can't load Oh, in. yes, Malik, my mistake. They need to make I it. I knew something didn't sound right. Oh, right, yeah, no, no worries. Yeah, Darth Malik, Darth Darth yeah. They need to make it so, um, is everybody, who unpaused it? Was that okay, you? I'm in now. Okay, we're good. All right, we're good. Hadri's here. He's here. All right, let's resume that bad boy and get this party started. Let's go, let's go spicing, man. Any Warhammer campaigns? No, I don't, I don't, I have very little interest in Warhammer campaigns. Um... Yeah, that's myself. Ooh, that's a good one. It's a nice little village trait there. The Harkonnen troopers looking all cool. All right, so you want to tag both those guys to mitigate their DPS. He already has a good village trait. Kill him. Well, it's not as strong with Harkonnens. If I was if I was Carino, this would just Carino, be backbreaking. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. I got the village trait that gives um, Plascrete to Solari, but I can only build like one Plascrete facility, so it's not like. It's not that that off the chains, you know. Yeah, Hadrius is Ecas. We have Max Ben Jim on Carino and Pone is on the Atreides, which is the perfect nemesis for the Baron. So it's uh, it's just outstanding. We are the the Great House Rumble. Yeah, it's gonna be good. I believe Ecas is in the extended kind of book universe that was written by his son. I don't think Ecas was in the original three, if I rem or in the original not three, but the original series. That's correct. Yeah. Which, but they're still cool. I, I like the flavor. Um, all right, let's do that. Let's do this. I mean, if I if I'm not mistaken, this is the first time in the history of this game that all the houses have been in the same match. Perhaps, yeah. Usually, there's like a fremen or um, so, somebody can confirm stream. for me. Maybe on turn uh, stream, yeah. No, no, no. I think just in the history of this game, ever. Yeah. <laughs> ever, ever. All right, so let's get another um, trooper. We're going to get aggressive here. Rail. Just going to go attack the Atreides right now, dude. Ugh. I forgot to build any military. I mean, Baron Harkonnen basically has like a full chub for just taking out the Atreides, obviously. So, yeah, it's like he's that's his power fantasy, you know, just taking down Duke Leto. It's probably what he goes to bed every night thinking about. All right. Let's see what's in this region. I mean, it's one of the tamer things he goes to bed thinking about. <laughs> yeah. yeah, he's he's pretty twisted. <laughs> The movies don't even like fully portray his like the depths of his depravity. Oh, no, they can't. Yeah, you that can't. Would be yeah. Very. Like... <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. In the books, he's he's way gnarlier for sure. Uh... Baron. Baron. Well, well, like, uh, like he's a Swifty or what? Ah, uh, maybe yeah, I don't know. Yeah. 
Diehard Swifty. Okay. Respect, put some respect on his name. Put some respect on the Baron. All right, we got our first spice field, which is great. Um, oh wow, you're doing really good. Yeah, you're you're behind already, dude. So Plastreet special region. That's why I'm kind of like shopping around for special regions before I grab anything. And also, you no, check Ducky, it. that was just a uh, that was, that was just a bug on your screen. What happened? He said he saw a game in progress about five minutes ago. That was all the houses. Hmm. Yeah, probably a bug. Yeah, that happens. Okay. These games can get buggy. So we're going to get local dialects, agent recruit speed, and then we're going to go down for the martial economy, which gives us the office of the oppression, which lets us suppress all our villages, which is pretty sweet. That. It's just, that's literally what the Harkonnen do. Is it still optimal to nuke Pwn? That's a great question. Um, I would say yes. <laughs> uh, nukes are no, way nuke easier to dodge these days. Yeah, they're the nukes are not as good. They're easier to dodge. And... The penalty for nuking is brutal. Like you're, you get sent back to the Stone Age. So, typically for nuking, I would say you only really want to do it on the heels of a domination victory. So if you're about to like wipe out someone's base and end the game, it's like a one v one. Yeah, but aside from that, it's very, very like risky. It's very risky. Risk or risque? Yeah, or risque. What he said, absolutely. <laughs> But it, it's it's so it's such a such a punishment when you um okay so we should probably grab those power cells and it, it does have a pretty good trait too. One of, us will die. One of us will die. So evil. <laughs> <laughs>, <laughs> Laughs and evil Baron sounds. <laughs> you have such a good witch's cackle, dude. Yeah, it's, it's just more old prospector. Yeah. <laughs> Cackling. The gold the gold rush. The gold rush. There's gold in these hills. Alright, micro that guy back a little bit. Where are you guys out of the map? I haven't I haven't discovered anybody with my drones yet. We're uh, we're kinda it's a little bit too I think, quiet. I think I'm actually on the planet Arrakis. Oh, okay, fair enough. I think I'm north. Yeah, I'm a northman. So with Harkonnens, you want to get militia quickly because your villages produce 5% more per militia. So if you don't have militia, you're kind of a potato. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah, as Harkonnen, I always build tons and tons and tons of the uh, manpower yeah. buildings. Ooh, process. And they're expensive too, so they can you can you find yourself in the red a lot as Harkonnen, but then you bounce back really quickly. Yeah, you absolutely can. Uh, cancel that because I see a village I want more, which is down here. So we're going to try and grab that one and see how that goes. All right. Let's get that. Save up a little bit more authority. This one's really good. It's a processing plant, special region. So we want it precious. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> Give it Give to, it me, to precious. me, precious. I was going to say, we should record that. You like playing Gollum in that? That'd be really good. All right, let's look around here. A couple fuel cells. I like to see it. Let's come down and just grab this. By the time we get through with it, it should be ready. Another spice field down there, which is great. And raiders on their way already. Ooh, evil raiders. Raiders. Supremely raiders evil. Out. Do you know if the uh, the order of the order that gives you um, the oppression mechanic does it increase the manpower that regions produce? Is it like every resource? I don't think it does. Uh, I think it's just like 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 spice and blast greed and like those type of things. Spice. <laughs> spice. That's what plants crave. All right, so we should have enough to grab this now. Advanced engineering, and we can go down to the martial economy here. Get that. This one's always pretty troll. The elected faction suffers. Although at this point in the game, I guess it's not bad since the spice economies are pretty pretty weak. I feel like I always get that one voted on me. Um, all factions suffer lands rat wow. standing. Yeah, that could be unlucky sometimes, you know. <laughs> yeah. Yes, yeah, good. We'll we'll just put it there. See what happens. All right. Oh, I got oh, I got old Carino here near me. All right. It's gonna get real crazy. All right, guys, we have Carino as our neighbor, which is a little bit scary. Let's go ahead here, we've reached that. So we will probably do the basic Solari one here. 
I don't think Carino is going to be able to get aggressive on us early because of the prevalence of... Uh, what does a special region do? This one gives you... Okay, an economy buildings. It's fine. We have the Plascrete. Cool. Another agent. Let's drop him in Arrakis. <laughs> Serve your Emperor Baron is what he says. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's true. He's got me there, guys. I can't argue against him. <sighs> do I want to get the water? Baron. The evil Baron's coming. You guys laughed at him, you know? But the big man is on the way. All right, let's sell a little bit more spice. Yes. Should have been selling the spice. Karate chopped by the worm. Did it eat you? It ate all of my guys. Yeah, that happens sometimes. No warning. What do you need? Let the worms feast. Dude, you can't. Exactly. You can't deny Shai Halud, dude. You gotta. You gotta pay his toll. Okay, spice field there, sixty nine. I would like that for sure. Um, I need a second size spice field. But for now, I'd say we go pillaging and hunting. Okay, so this region is processing plant. Um, let's go ahead and build some manpower here because we're going to start needing a surplus of that. Oh, House of Trades. <laughs> House of Trades can't raid, huh? <laughs> did, you guys, did you guys vote me for the, the spice thing? Uh, oh, man. Why, why, why is this? Lost that. I know. Great. Wow, that's crazy. You and Hadri's probably both did it, dude. Just pure evil. Well, if you look at the stats, it looks like it. a bit of everybody. Why? I'm not even the scariest, dude. There's a Carino in this game. Dude, Max Ben Jim was the one who dropped the hammer on you, though. You, dude, don't you, don't you deflect. Yeah. Dude, guys, I mean, me and, him, me and Hadri's were 100, but he was him damn probably. near 200. Him now. If I were you, I would go, I'd go attack him. Well, yeah, it's true. Him. I probably should. Well, I'm stockpiling right now anyways, so I'm just going to be stockpiling. Oh! Yeah. I ate my harvester. So if you if you if you guys are a little Shai bit killing us. if you get um if you happen to get like bad exchange rates like this, you just stockpile the spice until the rates are better. Um yes. Oh everybody got tanked on Landsrad standing, okay. Yeah, we're gonna be although none of us are in like pits for it yet. Yeah. It still sucks though, it lowers your influence, um yeah. and uh your chum buying price is basically in the pits of hell, so Pwn, the Baron, the Baron would offer, we should offer you a, a pact so I can betray you later. You know you want it. Yeah, that seems like a great idea. <laughs> the Baron, the betrayal. All right. Uh, there will be oppression soon. Raven is working on it. Don't worry. You got to, you got to get the tech though. It takes a little while to get there. What Karina should do is give the Harkonnen Sar Sardaukar so he can attack. Yeah, so I can attack Atreides. It's the true flavor. God, you guys all voted for me. That's so devious. That, I like, that was just unlucky on your part. <laughs> yeah, I think I, it's an act of... I, uh, I randomly... I randomly chose somebody to vote for. Okay. Totally random. Let's get this. What do we have in this region? So one building of each type here. So we get a Plascrete factory. Um, Looking pretty safe on the borders here. Plascrete factory, huh? Yeah. Need to kill you then. Yeah, you better. You better watch out. I have a Plascrete factory. Sorry. <laughs> you gotta go. I'm trying to decide what to play in the finals of the tournament. Um, I'm leaning... Uh, yeah, it's either Harkonnen or, I don't know, Fremen maybe. Fremen are just so fun. Um, but they are a little bit on the weaker side, obviously. We live to serve, serve Baron. Okay, let's go have some fun over here. Do a little bit of uh, ag aggressiveness. And then we need to get the filtration systems. Yes. Bo -bo -bo he's 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 on his way. The big man is uh, going to be causing some havoc around the realm. We live to serve. Yeah, manpower is kicking in now, which is good. Yes. We're not dead yet. I'm um, currently just banking spice for when the exchange rate gets better, and we're not in the pits of hell. We live to serve. It's going to be kind of hard with our water supply to really push until we get that. But now the Martial economy goodness is here, so let's do that. Get the Office of the Order there. And obviously we want to get it here too if we can. And that's going to be a nice little economic boon for us. Okay, keep grabbing whatever text we can. Carino's watching me. Menacingly? Yeah, they're, they're watching, dude. <laughs> the boy is watching. 
Let's see what text we unlocked here. Oh, nice. It's taking me a while to get my first sanctuary up because of just how the spawn worked out. Yeah, it can happen sometimes. The last time I played Ekaz, I got a sanctuary on my very first uh, like spice field takeover because I was so shoved up to the border of the map. That is really nice. Yeah, when you get those like blessed the blessed spawns. <laughs> yeah, cue the biblical hymns. Yeah. All right, guys. So we're saving up for a little water now because we're just like we we need that. And then once we get water, we can decide if we want to go get crunk on the map and whatnot. Um, we can actually take this. So let's go grab that. Are you the master of water? No, dude. I literally have two water right now. So. <laughs> It is quite the opposite. Landsrad standing. Diplomatic Congress. Okay, well, so obviously the Diplomatic Congress is going to be going to um, to the, to the what's it called? Carino. Trades. No, Carino. Well, Carino is the one who wants it the most. Carino yeah. just wants to just cackle an AFK, you know? Trades doesn't mind it either. Yeah, it's good for Trades too. Okay. Get all the militia so our villages are working efficiently. What do you need? Then hopefully we'll get the filtration system soon. Could build one of those temporary water buildings just in the meantime so I don't run out. The dew collector is pretty haggard, but better than nothing. Yeah, Fremen need some buffs. They're, they're cool. They have some mechanics that are strong. Like riding the Dreadworm is pretty heavy metal. You get like a huge damage buff. So if you can get like good surrounds with that, like you can be very, very nasty. But um. Aside from that, it ain't easy. And we got Ekaz and Pwn on the other side. Hello. I'm doing God knows what. Hey, it's me. It's your boy Pwn. What do you need? All right, cool. Then we need to start building some knowledge buildings. Um, so we'll get one here because we have the trait for that. Yes, All right, go get it, boys. So now you see these regions are being auto-oppressed. So basically that um, that will double the resources I get there, which is really nice. I always get a kick out of that, the office of auto-oppression. Yeah, just have to, we have to, you know, make sure everybody's uh, feeling equally oppressed in our Harkonnen culture here. Right up there with the Harkonnen Ministry of Silly Walks. Yeah, let's see what we get here. <laughs> it's just our lands are outstanding, just like all of us are in the pits except Hadri's. Oh yeah, I don't know. Oh, because I took a, I took a ship. Well, you can build the. You're better than me. <laughs> you can build the masterpieces and stuff too, which I believe give you three lands red standing per. All right, let's do a little bit of this. Oh, the water supply thing sucks so bad. Uh oh, turns thirsty. I am, dude. You got chunky. I'm just gonna like lose my whole army to supply in the desert here. I'm too weak. I hate it when that happens. It feels it, really it bad. It does happen in this game, which I think is appropriate. It's a very Dune situation. It is. Supply drops. Dune, Dune, Dune. All right, let's get back to our lands now. Another harvester here, which is great. We got our resources, and another agent now is out. All right, man. Thanks, guys, for joining today. It's been a fun little... uh. Duel of Fates so far. You're welcome, man. Thanks, Bone. Appreciate it, man. <laughs> Let's get that for the Solari production. And uh, this region kind of sucks, too, so we're going to just go beat that one up. The Baron is only here for the goodies. All right. Plasky factory limit. That's not bad. Was it 20% more efficient? All right, I'll take it. Hey, the exchange rates are good. I can start selling my spice again. Oh, See, so the rates got better, so now I'm just going to start selling that stuff, and we will uh, we will be all good. Bro, do you have some, like, Dark Lord strats over there? No. I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. I think he does. We're on <laughs> he is cheating. I am con convinced me otherwise. Yeah. The, well, I mean, the Baron would cheat, for sure. Oh, no doubt. That would be that would be all his jams. I would be disappointed if he wasn't. Let's cancel that. Get the water so we can start doing things again. Playing the game. What? Yeah. Do things? That's illegal. <laughs> Somebody a... stop him! Ready. Yes, 
Okay, so we can go up there in a minute with our goon squad. The water down there doesn't look too good. Yeah, ECAS is very good in Landsrad. Yeah, they are. They're one of the best political factions. My favorite um, trick with ECAS is the um, is the political art. That one's so good. It makes it so when you get elected to an office, it doesn't become eligible again, um, which is really, really cool. Okay, well, yeah, that's useful. Oh, I mean, yeah, it's like you, you can just lock down like Eye of the Council or Speaker of the Council or whatever, and you're just like chilling. You're just the, the cackle monster. Like a villain. Yeah, basically. All right, let's go. Let's go up here and get a little bit crazy. Okay, so that's gonna go for a while. Um, do we want to buy some spice? Probably not. Do that here. Looking for resources around that we want to grab. Nothing terribly like useful. Spice. I love the spice, dude. We're all about it. Finally, the water's gonna kick in here. Finally. No longer. So Harkonnen's no just gonna go. You suffer. Yeah, we've been suffering a while, dude. I got an action that will buff my um, my lands rat standing, so I finally won't be in the pits of hell with that. All right, so let's keep hunting here, keep getting aggressive. Yeah, everything's good, man. Having a good day. I love this game; it's so fun. You know, until Total War gets like a balance patch, it's it's like it's just kind of, <laughs> you know, the meta is a little bit stagnant. I'm sure Hadrius can attest to that as well. Yeah. Hadrius. He's just in the shadows. He he refuses to even talk about it. It's it's pretty. Oh, I am talking. Can you not hear me? You were quiet there for a second. Yeah, we didn't hear you. Oh, weird. Uh, but no, I agree. Yeah, a little stale right now. Dude, there is. Plus, a... this game is just so much more fun. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah, for sure. There's right so now many is, yeah. more. And Age of Age of uh, Wonders. I'm looking forward to that expansion. We get finally guns and. Uh, yeah, tanks yeah, and yeah. Here. It's gonna be awesome, dude. Uh, There's a steam tank coming in the Age of Wonders expansion. Yeah, man. The Empire. Your, you can tell your vassals to do stuff. Yeah, it's gonna be great. It's all I ever wanted. Okay, Lance Chad. Let's claim that reward. A lot of tempting stuff. What do you need? I want it all, baby. You gonna get it? Uh, no, probably not. I will try. Okay, so what do we got here and here? A little bit of plascrete for the boys. Let's get some knowledge since we're a potato and we haven't had any knowledge in a while. Uh-oh, I'm not going to be able to hold this. Your army's way bigger. Hold! <laughs> Go to your death, Harkonnens. Die in the dark. Hold on, if you feel like letting well, we knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> you can't let you have the best territory it's for so, free. It's man. so good. Oh no, is my base under siege too? Okay, the villagers got that. Jesus, <laughs> there was like an oppression man, and. Uh, Art Conan able to like handle their business with like their. Oh uh, man. The villagers. Well, it doesn't deal with like uh, other ones. What do I get now? Do we want? It doesn't to... deal with the uh, Fremen ones. No, it doesn't. No. Huh. Okay. No. So that's a little more fair. Yeah, it's only it's only with the other ones. This is probably one of the best landmarks, though. This one, the space rack, it's really good. It yeah. Gives you... Either I don't have enough to take it myself, but I can't let you have it. So oh yeah, that's fine. I pillaged. Yeah, you're close by too. So. Um. So let's grab this. Stopper. Um, probably not a bad idea to go ahead and get this. Yeah, I like that. It feels like a good idea. I feel so, like it's a general good advice in this game. If you see someone going for like super powerful landmark, like the crashed, uh, crashed uh, cruiser, you gotta, you gotta do something about that. Oh yeah, you're gonna want to shut it down. Ride. Yeah. Okay, good. We're all getting, we're all getting standing for some reason now. I don't know why, but. It appears to be the case. I think it's because we're all in a um, truce with uh, Atreides, so. Oh, okay. Sort of, every, every, if you're in a truce with someone, you get a bit of a Landstrad standing per cycle. Pwns being the homie then, huh? Yeah. 
Thank what you, am Bone. I doing? You're helping us. You, Damn it, Ekaz beat me out. How <laughs> dare you? I put in 210. I put in 220. It says 248. Um, let's go ahead like and that. do Chome and... Maybe some minor house I voted for me. I wanted that. Oh. Fuck the minor houses. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't need, I actually am not. I made a statement last night. I, I regret it. I was uh, on Ambien. <laughs> I'm actually not sure how the minor house system works like completely. Like I have a basic understanding, but like I don't. Yeah, I'm not 100% sure how they allocate all their votes and stuff. Okay, Baron. As you wish, master. Okay, Baron. Where is Pwn? Is he to the west of you? All right. Let me see. Let me figure this out. Yeah, he's to the no. Pwn is to the southwest of me. You are to the southeast of me. I am the lord in the north. Got it. Bro, I am. I am just doing me. That's mm -hmm. what I be doing. You're, you're just hanging out, huh? That is. Fair play, man. Fair play. Um, exchange rates are still decent. We can start finishing our villages here. Let's dive those if possible. We have the upkeep production on most of our bases, which is good. Proud of you. Thank you, man. It means a lot. We're just looking for goodies right now. We're truffling. Free Freebies. Carino, though the em the emperor looking awfully uh, awfully shady down there. Uh oh. I'm glad if Carino got that uh, starship. That well, Carino doesn't even need it. Fast. They don't need it, but it even helps them get it even faster. Yeah, Carino's Air Force is how I've been winning most of my games with them. It's it's really, really strong. All right, let's go down here. Go Eco. Gain intel when killing enemy units. Hmm. You know what? Let's actually slow that down and get this. Whoa, buddy, slow down. So you roll, man. You roll. Hey, you better calm down. You need to uh, practice Harkonnen with the second counselor. The difference is extreme from your army early game. No one will bully you. Yeah, I, I like the political counselors for the Harkonnen. Raven is like an auto take. You have to take him, in my opinion. Um, he's just so powerful. All right, let's, let's, let's get in there a little bit, shall we? I can't wait for my Landsrad standing to not be in the pits of hell. That's going to be so fun. Appropriate though, the Baron isn't the most popular chap in the land. Show. Well, he, but like, he plays ball. Like who he, it, he plays ball by blackmailing everyone. Like, hey, I know, I know your dirt. Well, he worked with the Emperor, you know. Them, he's like, he know, he knows when, he's like, he knows when someone outmatches him, and he's just like rolls with it, you know. Yeah. The like, Papa Palpatine. What's yeah. going on? Yeah. Uh, let's get the spice region there. Once we have enough plascrete. I hate having to turn a uh, wonder site into a sanctuary, but you don't have to. Probably no. Well, your okay, options yeah, a little limited. Have to. Mm. I don't think they're very good, but the Cerberus unit for them is it's really cool. it's really good. Yeah, no, they're great because they trigger the death penalty. A lot of Harkonnen, like you get buffs when things die, so you mix a couple in to like get a bunch of stacking triggers on your uh, on your stuff. And you can you can be an absolute terror for sure. Um, oh, that's right. I do need that building here. Let's get rid of the stupid dew collector. Do it, stupid <laughs> dew collector. Um, let's grab that for the free tech. What do you need? All right, guys. The big yeah. man, the big baron's getting rolling slowly but surely. You're pissed? Not really. I'm just gonna. What's going to happen is I'm going to be locked in Mortal Kombat with the, um, probably with the Emperor while you guys, well, Hadrius will cackle in the north uncontested and probably win. <laughs> Unless you attack him, of course, but we'll see. Oh, I would never. I'm, I'm peaceful. Atreides. Atreides, the peaceful yeah, 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 so he's probably going to have a pretty good time. P peace. Okay, let's a get piece of what, though? Peace. Man, a lot of plascrete there. All right. Um... So nothing I can really vote for here is terribly pertinent. We have that. Let's go ahead and just take that for its parts and do a little bit of raiding again. All right, cool. So that's coming together. We definitely need more manpower. What do you need? The penalty. 
Damn peasant uprisings here, dude. Give me all the trouble. Yikes. I know. It is pretty fun seeing the, the, the money flow in as the Harkonnens, though, you know? Ah, oh, come on. Got to go down there and deal with that. Some haggard AI. Just diving my bases. <laughs> Die! They're, they're, that's what they're saying right now. They're coming for me pretty hard. As a matter of fact. You've lost. Um, all right, so it's pretty pricey there. The trooper should make it down there in time. Interrogation centers are cool. They give you intel when you kill enemy units and you um, get a high chance of getting more brainwashed agents. Uh, I do send the... I attach my harvesters to my... Um, my drones to my harvesters when... Rip harvester. Uh, when I scout the entire map. And I like know where everything is. Because they're still out scouting stuff. So, um, But I do eventually do that, yes. I attach my drones to my harvesters when I get them from the... Um... The little, the little treasures you pick up? Yeah, the crash like sites, the, yeah. The crash sites, yeah. That gets really useful. It is indeed. Speaking of, I have a couple of those lying around I should probably grab. Alright. So this region has got water as well. Um, so let's go ahead and get... We, we're going to need a lot of that to keep going. Carino's buying some shares. Ecaz buying a little bit too. Not nothing Trying. too crazy. Yeah, it's a little hard to keep up. Okay, let's buy this and this. Definitely need all those buildings. The main base is coming along nicely. I want to learn this game, but I keep messing. Oh, dude, it takes some. It takes some reps to learn. Don't stress it. It's and who cares? Yeah. You know? Yeah, just play against. It is really, it's one of those games where it, it's genuinely even still fun when you like just play and just just playing it is fun. Yeah, oh yeah. Uh, win or lose. So, what yeah. isn't fun though is when you get like shut out completely and like uh, locked down early. Yeah. So then they just don't play say the fremen and you'll two, be fine. Yeah. Say <laughs> two. Say two guys uh, basically lock you in and the, as fremen and. You can't do anything. It feels bad. Well, Fremen, yeah. Fremen are apparently pretty good early, according to some people. But I struggle. What I struggle to deal with with Fremen is ranged units kiting me, like um, like snipers for smugglers, for example. Mm -hmm. It feels incredibly difficult. Um, yeah, incredibly difficult. Uh oh. What is this? That is a lot of units. All right. So it could be getting aggressive here. We have the Padishah Emperor creeping up on our borders. So we're going to take our troops down there and defend this just in case. Um, let's grab the water here. It's a good water region. We don't want to be empty on water. We'll grab water here too. Militia are fighting off most of the rebellions and whatnot. I believe... Oh, our lands are outstanding. We're finally in the green. You've been in the red the whole time. Well, you, I got was minus thirty, and you, you, like I had no way of yeah, getting. That's, yeah, that's rough. Yeah, it's like so. It's there, there goes my political ambitions for sure. Glad I'm not you. I know, dude. You, uh, you know, Yeesh. you're in good shape. Okay, so let's get militia. Are you hitting on me right now? <laughs> Maybe so. So a bit of a standoff. Landsrad Punishers. Okay, so those are a unique unit that won't be around forever. For sure. Um, yeah, this is this is multiplayer right now. Yeah, I'm on the Harkonnens and we have... Um, where is this? Spice Harvester. Cool. First time on a turn stream, huh? Okay, let's do... What the hell? The in sleep. most of my games, I feel like I always spawn a, across, like far across from Carino, and I can never, I can never get at them. Yeah, they're a menace, dude. Don't worry. I mean, you know, I, I'm pretty experienced with dealing with Carino and fighting them. I mean, I might lose, but at least I'll try and stop them. <laughs> it won't be free. Is what I'm saying. Your sacrifice will be honored. Yeah, you'll be able to political victory while I fight Carino to the death. <laughs> Your 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 uh, interests are secured. Man, the uh, the harvesters are just having the worst 
worst days of their lives. Are they just being chain eaten by the worms or what? <laughs> they are. They'd be like, they'd be like, hey, congrats, you get to be a spice collector. Big, like, oh hell no. <laughs> that's that's the way of doom. They've all died. Every last one of them. Okay, we got our Fremen mercenary um, here. Probably want an airfield, honestly. Would be a good idea, although, eh, let's just be greedy and take another Plascrete. Greed is good. The Baron would be greedy. Uh, yeah, Carino, well, you saw the Carino tournament game. Carino, I, I feel I like pretty much mastered. Um, I've been playing them a ton. Um, and they're, they're so top tier. Like, Carino is freakishly strong. Their hegemony victory is just nuts. Oh, he just dropped an Imperial base in my face, by the way. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I hate that so much. That's what we call a power move. Yeah, but if they lose it, they're just behind for like the rest of the game. It's it, it is risky. Emperor. Yeah, he better hope you don't get those Landstrad Punishers. I know the Landstrad Punishers are coming, dude. Did you get those? Who got those? I I no, he got them. So he's just sitting all pretty over there. Uh huh. And, uh, yep, let's get some of that. Need to get the Spacing Guild stuff. Uh, what regions do we have buildings in? I guess we could build over there. Probably gonna want to slap down a military base here in case things get crazy or a missile turret. Things would never get crazy. Oh, they're going to, dude. So this region have? I know. Pone wants to be a sanctuary. I'm gonna make this <laughs> like I'm gonna surround this for you, Pone, and you're gonna I'm gonna give you sanctuary. Pone has become the sanctuary. Is that how that works? No. No. <laughs> yeah, look at this Imperial base here. That's a pretty ballsy position for sure. Okay, let's do that. And then um, as far as other buildings go, we can do a little bit of an alteration. Delete that. Take the Plascrete, deal with the rebels. I basically just sacrifice the brainwashed agents as I kind of get them. Kill them. But for now, you can go on lands rad. Come on, get out of combat here. And perfect. Let's get this. We'll get the upkeep production building here. And then we can grab the military base there. So that will hit like all these regions. That's prime time. That's really good. Yeah, that's uh, that's some nastiness from Carino. It's very, very nasty. I'm gonna solidify my eco before I get dragged into any conflict. But um, does labor rights hit everybody, or is it just one person? All factions. Yeah, it's all factions. Okay, cool. I wasn't sure if it was just me being sent into the pits of hell. Let's get the spice harvesters going. I will see you there, brother. Yeah, we'll be we'll be partying, Pone and I, in the suffering. Alrighty. Still doing reasonably okay financially. The Baron is, is cackling. Yeah, I mean, if Karina loses their second base, it sets them behind hardcore. Like, very, very hard. So, I suspect he'll do everything he can to maintain that. Yes. What is it, Master? What is it, Master? Baron? The voice acting for the Harkonnens is pretty fun, for sure. My favorite are the smugglers, because they just sound so weary, like, we kill without warning. Yeah, the smugglers are pretty great. Okay, military base there. That here. We have another random region, which really doesn't do much for us. Um, we could do a little bit of pillaging, which probably isn't a bad idea. Space and guild time. Yeah, that's still a little bit hard. Okay, bases are being developed well. Hmm. Yeah, that's a good one. We'll get that and then we'll just start hitting military tech. Which we're gonna need to deal with this this Imperial incursion. I'm gonna buy that spice before he gets it. <laughs> All right. So we just got the 10% on, on shares just to try and get some influence because we're just like basically a pit lord. <laughs> Our lands are outstanding is the worst. The Baron not having a good time at all. Mm -hmm. 
Slap that down. Outstanding. And now it's a little bit calm. A little bit calm, ladies and gentlemen. It's so... Uh, it, could you see the uh, far right of the map? I see Pwn annexing your uh, your Sandfall village up there. Look how calm it is. Oh. No, we... It's an, uh, it's, uh, you know, sanctuary. I'm providing the Atreides with the uh, protection. That's nice. Yeah, that's great. Look how safe that uh, building is. You're protecting them from the Baron and his foul I'll schemes. Protect, I'll protect them from themselves. Yeah. Save me from myself. It's like every early 2000s, like, like new metal song. All right, let's get that going. Um... This village kind of sucks, so... Eh, Solari per statecraft building isn't terrible if you wanted to make that like a... Statecraft region. Okay. Let's grab you and you. Put my life into pieces. <laughs> yeah, that was, that was a magical <laughs> time for music, for sure. Alright, so all is calm with the Emperor so far. My income isn't amazing, but we do have good spice production. Which is cool. Oh my god, the mass rebellions with Harkonnen are so stressful when everything just goes at the same time. Just like yeah, when you, all of a sudden all of your dying. numbers say you're losing, <laughs> and you're like, oh! <laughs> what what passed? Yeah. That's new metal lyrics for you, it is. But we get intel every time we kill a rebel, so it's like pretty great. Harvester and work in order. All right. I think they should elect the Baron to the Eye of the Council. Baron? Well, we have... I mean, we have two very political factions. Both you and Pwn are super political, so... Baron. Yes. Yeah. Ready, Baron. <laughs> yeah, you guys are both going to be battling it out for the votes. I oh, should just vote... Oh, oh, oh. I'll just vote for whichever one of you is weaker. Just play... Oh. <laughs> Turn you, no, turn you against I'm one another. Weak. Please don't <laughs> kill me. Alright, let's do that. We're looking good at our shares. Hi, the council. Oh my god, look at that. <laughs> Sounds good, Max Ben Jim. I will I will work with you, brother. We will declare it since you and I uh, denied. Yeah, okay. It's no eye of the tiger. He better actually follow through and not just like leave me leave me holding the bill there, you know? <laughs> I was playing in a public game and some guy was like, Yeah, deny this one, like I'll join you and he just he just voted for something else in his interest. I was like, <laughs> You son of a gun, dude. <laughs> you know? I was like, What the hell is this? Ch -ch 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 it was pretty funny for sure. But you know, you can't you can't win them all. All right, so that's going. Could certainly try. Get them, Anakin. Good. Kill them all. All right, cool. Research. Hey, we finally have a siege revealed. Um, let's start trading it. Yeah, water for manpower. I'm down for that party. That sounds pretty good to me. Don't want to be just like you. You want to be just like the Baron when you grow up? Oh, that's nice. Don't want to be just like you. Uh, Carino can sponsor my villages if they have that agent. I don't know if they do. I doubt it. Um, what I'm saying is, turn is that this is the anthem. Throw all your hands up. Oh my god, dude, you're just going too hard right now. Don't want to be you. That was um. Hold on, I'm trying to remember who that was. That was uh. Oh, don't tell me. You want a hint? No. Stop. It's um uh good good Charlotte, right? Or yeah, was that was that right? You were hell yeah, dude. Let's go. You remember the name of the song? Is it called the anthem? It is. <laughs> we got that. I am the eye of the cow. You won that? Holy shit, that's a lot of votes for me. Hey, wait. I oh did I I accidentally voted Thank for you. you folks. My Mis man! <laughs> oh, that, that was yeah. actually a misclick. That's, that's how that usually goes. Okay. Well, let's see how this Mr. goes. Mr. 
sitting here talking about this other guy trolling and turns is like, <laughs> that, that was actually a misclick, bro. I swear. <laughs> only Terran, er, only only Pwn will take control of the <laughs> council. I was I was legit joking when I said that, dude. Pwn is the Landstrad. We must defeat him. Okay, well this is an interesting little duel of fates up here. Oh my god, you got them to... Oh... Harkonnen. Yes. Err... Baron! <laughs> Baron! <laughs> Uh, I forgot to switch it because I like was like thinking about voting for Pwn for a second and I was like, no, that's like stupid and then I just <laughs> I accidentally did it. Yes. Yes, evil Harkonnen. Confused Harkonnen. You guys see I see I see you put our differences in the past. I have, we're we're pals now. Yeah. It's all's good in the neighborhood. I tried to grab this cool little site, but Hadri said no. He was just like, yeah. I'm not, <laughs> hey, I'm not taking it either. I'm saying nobody gets it. <laughs> yeah. Nobody yeah. gets to have fun with me here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, just just the suffering. All right, so let's get you. We need this. Let's get some manpower buildings here. And um, that should be ready soon. All right. Yes. Isn't that funny? The haggard, like, toxic cloud just forcing everyone. <laughs> Look at the toxic cloud, guys. Holy shit, that that's That is funny. pretty troll. Yeah. Now I'm, like, panicking. I was like, oh, God, is he killing me somewhere? No. Oh, uh, why? Because I was killing... laughing? He's killing me with some, like, nonsense. Killing you with kindness. Yeah. Tell him you don't want to be just like him. He doesn't. He doesn't want it. I don't want to be just like you. God, dude, that era of music. It's just its just something else. The best. Yeah, it's pretty magical for sure. Um, all right, so let's go ahead and get a little spice silo here. Probably not a bad idea. For you, Baron. God, attacking into Harkonnen is just the most miserable. No, mystery. nothing's worse than Atreides. Don't you put that evil on us, dude. No, no. Atreides with their 1,200 Harkonnen HP militia. Kill you. <laughs> They're Harkonnen awful. They actively kill you with passive, like... You get a mortis effect on your uh, land. It's good. It's very good. Cheap. I'm sac I sacrificed agents to make that happen, though. To be fair, so it wasn't like it was like the best thing in the world for me. Um. All right. Let's grab you. Spacing branch. I guess we just do a little bit of that for now. Adrius wants the mortis engine, round two. He's coming back for it. Can't keep this guy. Which guy? Hey, yeah. All right. I'll be back. Goodbye forever. I'll be back. And in greater numbers. I'm gonna make like zero effort. Just hold that base. I, I just know it's it's on it's on borrowed time. It's too hard to defend up there. Although he's kind of far too. He has to like shuttle over. Yeah. So that's the one that gives you extra spaceship parts, which I haven't had any up until this point, really. <laughs> the Baron farted. And now that you have it, you get all of the spaceship parts. I get two. Oh, well, I have two right now. I have one plus one, so it's it's pretty decent. But, like, it's not like the Carino who just literally gets, like, three for nothing. It's, it's like, they're they're just the true cackle monsters. Um, all cackle, right. cackle, cackle. How do we want to do this here? We have upkeep production. We could do data center. For a little bit of intel. Um, Shit, the fat renegade army. Are the renegades coming? I think so. Hmm. I see. I want to attack the Imperium, but Hadrius is poking me there, so I kind of have to watch that. Um, Not the dreaded hokey pokey. <laughs> hey, Judge of the Council, <laughs> just vote Pwn on accident again. Is, is, yeah, just vote Pwn. <laughs> you might as well. Yeah. All factions suffer spice exchange rate. Look at that. Boo! Hi, nice. I'm good. I'll decline that. Yeah, I'm gonna decline judge this time. H how about no? You know you you know, Pwn. Your evil schemes must come to an end someday. What? Yeah, you heard me. Okay, let's just grab this. Screw it. It's more territory to build stuff on. Um, Give me it back to you, the people. I know. 
Pedris has this big cool mothership already. How did you get it so quick? Did you find some parts on the ground or something? Something like that. Yeah. It just intercepted, uh... That army is definitely marching its ass all the way up to attack you, Hadris. I am intercepting this guy. Thank you. See, I protect your uh, hegemony zone. It and works out protect... for the two of us. Oh, is there like an AI army or something? A fat renegade army. Yeah. Pwn well, and me, we're in this together. Don't act like that helps you, though, because he just stole spaceship parts from you. Those things are good because they drop sh uh, ship parts when they attack. You can you can get no, them. We're all stealing spaceship parts from each other. I'm just <laughs> I just stole ten from you from your land. Yeah, yeah, you, you found some goodies. Anything for you, Baron. Anything for you, Baron. All right, upgrades. Let's see what we want to get. It's interesting. Hmm. Health per day. You can't be healed while in combat. Wow, that's interesting. Uh, let's see this and let's see that. Don't know if those are the right upgrades, but we're learning trial by fire. I am very poor at the moment. And this one gives me, yeah, space and guild stuff. Favors, um, let's just set that up there. And here, let's get some wind traps. And uh, yeah, all's calm right now. Pretty chill, actually. God, that Imperial base is just so trolly, though. The one right in my face there. Oh, it's awful. It's awful, dude. Baron, we're, here for you. we're here for you, Baron. All right, it's time for the big, the big guns to come out. Do this. For you, Baron. The Harkonnen have a really cool mothership. I don't know how good it is compared to some of the other ones, but it's like uh, it's basically like a StarCraft... Uh, like a StarCraft... Uh, like... Protoss carrier. It's uh, it's very fun. All right, so that's going fine. I think we can cut this out now. Start building some influence. In the Baron, eyeing the territories nearby, seeing if there's anything worth getting. Intel, statecraft. Per okay, we can grab that. We're kind of running out of space to grab things. Maps becoming very crowded. Oh, are you and Hadri's? <laughs> Did he just surround your your site there? Yeah, I, I sniped that way earlier. Oh, that's right. I got I got confused. Yeah, that makes sense. All right, perfect. Why we're such good friends? It'd be a, it'd be. Oh. Yeah, all lies. You guys are the best pals. Yeah, that's nice. It's good to know that in a world of hardship, you know, friendships can uh, can thrive. Exactly. Plascrete, and uh, in this region, what do we want to get? Probably drop you down. Not as rich as I would like to be, that's for damn sure. How rich would you like to be? I don't know, I feel like I don't have the most money. Yeah, Hadri's, holy shit, Hadri's has 16k. Dear God. Holy shit. <laughs> I, I'm at 4k, and I'm like, man, I, I'm rich. You're pretty then, rich. Uh, no. God, it's yeah, everyone's a threat. My place. How's Carino doing? Okay, Carino's not really playing hegemony, so I think we're safe for now. Wait, they're not. No, or he's only got 12k right now. Not... So, well, hold on. Let's look at their buildings. Okay, I don't see double craft workshops yet. He might be playing possum, letting us mm -hmm. letting us do battle and then uh, you know cackling it up. I mean, Atreides. How are they? Yeah, Atreides is the Dark Lord of hegemony. I mean, they have barely more than me, so. The thing is with Hedge, you, unless you, like, Carino, Hedge is usually easy to stop unless you're Carino, you know. Do you feel safe? Is he talking, uh, who, are, who are you talking to? Who are you talking to? <laughs> Do you feel in charge? <laughs> I'm curious. He's getting real menacing over there, dude. I have no idea who Homeboy's talking to. All right, let's grab you guys. You will never get to know. Baron. Baron. All right, let's grab that. It's a pretty good one. Um, as far as these go, Speaker of the Council. Do you want to gain some lands rad standing? No, thank you. Had fun. Hey, Fuda Man, I'm glad you had fun last night. Yeah, the A stream was a great time. Uh, we need one more here. So that's fully built, that's fully built. 
Class creep is not really necessary at this point. Intel buildings are always useful in the late game. All right, so yeah, we have a lot of goodies for sure. Stealth probes, yeah, those ones give you a nice little buff. Chum support is cool. Hmm. Go, my troopers. What do you need, Baron? All right, so we have some we have some good ones. We have some good ones indeed. Kind of playing defensively. I thought I'd be richer, but the Hadrian's just slapping us all. In yeah, the face. he's not buying shares with it, so I guess it's just it's just surplus that he's chilling with, which is which is good. Probably going to attack me at some point. <clears throat> not impossible. <laughs> Uh, the idea crossed his mind. I don't know if that was worth, but... And trade, he's up for Speaker of the Council, huh? Oh, stop that. Yeah. Let's hey, me! Wait a minute. Speak! Wait a minute. How did... How did... <laughs> oh, okay. Is Pwn going to be the, the speaker here? The requirement. The requirements. On Everybody that listen to me! <laughs> God, I wish I could nuke you, dude. You know. One voice! <laughs> Everybody. Everybody wants the pwn nuke, for sure. Oh. Yeah, well, decline speaker. I, I don't want it. We're here for you. I like me. We're here for you. Barrett. Let's get some water there, because why the hell not? Um, we, seem, we seem to be okay. You're all right. We're hanging in there. You're okay. You're all right. Yeah, it's God, I hate when the storm. The storms always just tend to fly over right when you want to like do something. Yeah, yeah, I feel that. They're yeah. there That's what happened fall. when I was going to uh, intercept you taking that, and a gi giant storm just right in my face. Yeah, it's pretty okay. sure. Sounds like my Friday night. Yeah. Wait. That's fair. <laughs> okay, let's do that. Um. And then we can go get that next, which I think will be useful. Let's get this. For a little upkeep production of the gods. Nice water here. What the hell is that? Where is this thing? Oh, God. Go forth, minions, and prosper. Got yeah, it. Yeah, we're not gonna we're not gonna blood feud at all. Well, this isn't even blood feud. You're you're so rich and powerful. Also, that's a that's a palace or whatever. It's gonna cost you. Ah, uh, dude, I don't care. I'm already in the lands red pits, dude. Okay, it's gonna cost. <laughs> you. I would like to once again thank the people for voting for me. Oh god, my army's about to get steamrolled. <laughs> get them. I like how our both neither of our motherships are there. They're both like waddling to the Yeah, that's something I've noticed playing Ekaz. Like as Carino, it feels like your mothership is like always in. Yeah. Up and it's all run around like whoop, 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 whoop. How is that? My units are stronger. Whoop, 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 whoop. Go, my drones. Get them. Yeah, now, now I just get trolled by air. <laughs> like, it's so... Mi air superiority is so... I mean, I'm not even that superior in the air department. Let's be real here. <laughs> yeah, except you just sniped my shit. Like, it's such a... Oh, you're, you're what? You're champion? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Well, Harkonnens, you want to be fighting like this because you get access to the, um, uh, you get intel when you kill th kill things. So if you're not fighting, you're kind of wasting your potential. All right, so what can we do here? Yeah, we could throw that down. Don't know if it's worth it. I'm happy with that though. It's fine. We lost. Oh my god! It was way more land threat standing than I thought. Holy shit! Yeah, I I was warning you, man. Yeah, it's too uh, late. We're blood feuding, and Karina's gonna. <laughs> Uh, Karina's uh, behind on hedge still, so I'm not. I'm not worried about them. I can turn on them at any point. 
I did gain, and that's what they all think. Yeah. <laughs> oh, for sure. All right, let's grab you. Let's get these I guys. Have the council coming back up. Oh yeah, pwn one speaker somehow. If you were in the pits, do a nuke. That well, the low standing isn't. It I only lose out on influence, and I guess the chum buying price thing sucks. But I can get back to two hundred. It'll take a take a hot moment here, but I'd have to I'd have to make more agreements with the Atreides. Hello, my people, my friends. The Imperial base of Carino definitely needs to pay. God, how do you have 28,000 gold, dude? How is that even possible? What? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> how is Adrian so rich? Dear God. I don't pay attention to this stuff. My accountant just said don't worry about it. Do you guys see how rich he is? Oh my God. This could very well be a nuking game though, guys. Someone's gonna get nuked. That. Oh my god, the chum prices. At least we got our percentage before the doom toll came up. Alright, has anybody tried the Harkonnen gunners with the machine gun upgrade? They're really good if you spam them, but uh, they don't feel like they contribute too much if it's just like one or two. Yeah, That's yeah. Just Makes sense. I've seen. Anything for you. Anything. Uh, Harkonnen have some wacky things they can do with their uh, comps. Ew. They took the middle. It's fine. He and can... their speaker. They have access to. We have to kill Pwn. I'm, I'm. I'm. What? You get. You can use that thirty thousand gold to kill him. <laughs> Start spending some of that, dog. You're so rich. No, I... We both that know fine. that would be a most unwise move. <laughs> oh God, Carino's base and my base is so annoying. It like is stifling my expansion. All right, so let's get you. The good news is after you attacked my. Uh garden yeah there's no way for you back into the political game no no, no. I, I'm, I'm i never was in it anyways i wasn't lying when i said i was in the pits financially all right let's get some upgrades um can you get both those oh so i can get range attacks destroy armor and then the machine gun upgrade together oh that's a cool combo so then like the gatling guns mow down armor oh that's rad okay i really like that oh breaker Dude, we just found the most OP combo in the game, guys. Holy OP. shit. Okay. How are we looking? Do we want to expand anymore? We do have our little spaceship parts, which is cute. Hey! Eye of the Council. Let's do it. He's the Eye of the Council. I'm just going to like use my pitiful ass votes to like decline that. I still have some influence, actually, despite everything, which is pretty cool. All right. It's the Eye of Professor Pound. Okay, so that's already finished. Um, that's already finished. Yeah, we'll save that brainwashed agent for later. For now, slap him up here. And uh, we can get this last building here. Hey, still making some good dough, though, baby. Still making some good dough. Still got it. I see him all loaded up in the crack in here. God, this Imperial base is just tor tormenting me, dude. I hate it so much. Um, how can we do that? What are we missing for this? Oh, man. Okay. I think that was that. Um, scrolling up. That's that, and where is the one that we really want? This oh, hell one. Hell no, no renegade base is here. Okay, so that needs to be here. Got it. The Harkonnen schemes are here. Um, I mean, Hadrius can easily slow Pwn's hedge down. He literally has a sacred site like surrounded. It's really funny. So yeah. any complaints <laughs> about Pwn's hedge, I'm I'm not going to take too seriously. Oh. <laughs> Unless Pwn wants to like fly up there, which he maybe could. No, I just want to win, baby. Carino not really pushing the hedge game too much. Although now they are grabbing a craft of the White Rift down there, so I'm probably going to have to do something about Carino soon. Oh, uh, the White Rift, doesn't that uh, double hedge production? Yeah, it's, it's it's really good, so I'll probably attack when they get, get going on that. The White Wolf. <laughs> just Pwn just randomly saying the White Wolf. Like... All right, what do we got here? Um, let's get a little bit more manpower. We might need it for the conflicts to come. 
I am in the absolute dumpster politically, which is my favorite thing ever. The Baron belongs in the dumpster politically, though. That's where he's. That's where he should be. I'm not the eye anymore. Did you lose your loss of rights? Who got the? Uh, he lost it. Adrian. Oh, cool. We can chill out with Adrian. I'm good with that. What? Well, I was watching. I'm gonna turn my sights on Carino for now. I just wanted to secure my spaceship field up there. Yeah. Which I'm happy about. Um. Yeah. All right. I mean, he can come after it, but I'll just drop some barren fart gas on him. <laughs> and kill the army for free with one ability. Yeah. Well, you know the Harkonnen agent, uh, Peter? So every time you sacrifice an agent to a mission, it becomes permanently it cheaper. Permanently. Yeah, yeah it's money. So, I, yeah. There are some silly things in this game. Yeah, which is what makes it fun. Yeah. Do we got an airship? Is it up? Oh, you're eligible now. Okay. I would respect the governorship, dude. If you got it, that would be that would be fun. We could we could all just go all in on Pwn Dog. Have a glorious oh, yeah. duel. Or, or you could just support me. Dude, the Baron would never support. The right as the rightful ruler of Arrakis. You know, yeah, just justice for the Atreides, dude. That's true. Yeah, you guys were wrong. So you know, it's it's only fair, right? Yeah. Finally, that's the first sensible thing you've said all game. Yeah, that's true. You, you you caught me. Your logic is impeccable. No, nobody likes the lands rat anyways. It's a bunch of nerds. Hey, Jers! <laughs> is he attacking you? <laughs> yeah, I see the ceasefire over there. Oh, Pwn. Pwn using the haggard tricks of the Atreides to survive. That's so fun. Get out! <laughs> Get him! How many times can you do that, though? many as I need. Yeah, probably not. He could probably buy like a couple minutes here, but um, I should have just randomly drop the toxic vapors over there. Like, <laughs> oh, <Adrian. laughs> That'd be so dumb. He would. Like, Poen and Turin 2v1 me every Well, it's because you're good and you're winning a lot, dude. You don't, you don't act all innocent too. over there. It's not like we did it out of, out of the lulls. Yeah, dude. You just said... <laughs> Sometimes I'm not actually doing it die. though. Sometimes it's for the lulls. I want. I just want you to stop him, dude. Because I'm. I'm gonna try and deal with Carino, and you deal with uh, whatever you, whatever you got here. Carino's looking reasonably jacked. I don't know. Are they looking swole? Yeah, they're looking pretty good. I'm just grabbing this. All right, let's run back down here. Um, let's spend some manpower here. Get the fuel cells of the gods. Man, that is taking a long time to research, ladies and gentlemen. Lands are outstanding. Dune governorship. Oh, yeah. Ecaz is up for it too. Okay, deny gov. If you don't, if either of you guys don't have enough, just deny the other person. Whoever it is. That's how it goes. That's how it should go, but it often doesn't. Yeah, who knows? <laughs> All right. So the gov governorship is coming up. It's kind of like a wonder victory as well. Pwn's in the lead, prep the nuke. <laughs> the Baron goes out on his shield. This is <laughs> a true warrior, you know? Uh-huh. I don't think any of that's going. All right. So now let's go here. Get one of our crappy brainwashed agents. And I believe it's... I have to read up on this real quick. It only requires two, right? Yeah, there we are. All right. Cool. Get you back there. <laughs> are you just dying or what? I did not win that fight. <laughs> no, he did not. Okay. Here we go, guys. This is This is the party time. Are we on an alliance right now? What the hell is you this got shit? The thing. Oh, it's fine. I just got it out off him, so I have enough. Defense breaches. Combat drugs. Dude, I'm gonna melt the hell out of this base, bro. It's time. You lie. It's kind of getting melted a little bit. I already got it down pretty far. If he loses this base, he's gonna lose so much tech. Okay, don't forget to decline governorship. Oh my god! Hey, Drew, is you talking about killing bases? The Harkonnen Gatling Gunners? 
with the uh, combat drugs. Oh man. Yeah. Nice. That's uh, that's that's some damage right there. Or as the French would say, damage. It would say that. Here he comes, toxic vapors. Defense sabotage. Oh, I killed, I think I'm about to kill his face. Holy shit. Well, he did put it right in your face. Yeah, dude, like, what do you expect? You're killing it, you're killing it from inside your own territory, jeez. Yeah, now I'm just gonna pull back and mow down his army as it comes. Calls came from inside the house. <laughs> Bone just with some random horror movie anecdotes here. <laughs> Oh my god, I just annihilated the Karino army too! <laughs> oh, evil! Dude, Harkonnen are so fun, I don't care if I win this game, this is worth every second. Oh! <laughs> evil! But at what cost? Very little, dude. I mean, that was just obliteration. Like, he's out his main base, do you know how behind he's gonna be now? And now I just am in the pits, because I can't catch up to either of these guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, now who do we go after? I mean, I knocked Pone down a bit, but... Yeah, but now you're up there, too. It's like a... a it's like a... Lose-lose for the old... The old chonky Baron here. Thing is, I don't have... Uh, what you call it? Too much... Um, too much passive hedge, is what you're saying? No, I don't have uh, craft workshops yet. Suit. At this, at this rate, you, sh you shouldn't have said yet, dude. You should have just left it at. You don't have them. Oh. Okay. No more shit house imperial base in our face trolling us. <laughs> Pure bloated evil. <laughs> the Burger King. I think if I just played politics a little better too, I could be in this game. But I'm just having so much fun being a degenerate. You know, it's uh. You yeah, you tanked yourself out of. The We're game. going nukes, baby. We're getting nukes. Okay, there we go. The nukes are coming. Yes, dude. Uh, what is my hedge at? I'm actually not even that far behind you guys. Although, oh, does right uh, let me see. Let's look at Carino's. Okay, Carino is only just. How did one of my people get? Thing. How did how's Ecas capture one of my people? Uh, if, did you launch an, uh, uh, a mission while you were like fighting uh, around them? Yeah, probably. Yeah, so that'll do it. Yeah. No, no, you will Give die. her back. Oh, uh, they escaped on their own. Good <clears throat> on you. Yeah, some of those agents are troopers, man. Yes, the holy nuke. We're going full in the evil Harkon in this game, like... This is like when the Baron's desperate and his back's against the wall, you know? This is this is what that's gonna represent. Just just pure. Dude, that Imperial base, if you kill Carino's second base, it just ruins them, dude. It's like, it's just such punishment because they lose all those major buildings. All right, Carino's gathering down here. Probably gonna take this too if I can. Set up a turret. At least I finally have the most money in the game. That's something to be proud of. Pretty sure I can win this fight. This is, does not look like much. Oh, you do. Holy Double shit. Double controlled markets. That's pretty funny. Alright, so let's go ahead and grab that. Oh yeah, Pwn still has speaker. Shit. <laughs> yes, evil. Evil. Dude, Carino's getting mowed down, bro. By the dread Harkonnens. Okay, let's kill all these. To slow them down. We need some Cerberus. Looks like a decoy thumper was used, which is fine. Not going to do a whole lot. And, um... I mean, we have a lot of money, and we, we're not in the political game, right? So might as well spend it on some good stuff. And sacrifices as well. All right, missile turrets coming up. The Atreides will die in the dark. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it might. Well, you guys, wait, you wait, guys you are. Passed, you passed me in the hedge. I have, but I uh, probably kill Harkonnen. <laughs> I probably won't be able to get too much more, but I'll try. I'm trying to, I'm liberating bases for us right now. I'm slowing down the old, uh, 
Carino. Hopefully Do there's it for us. I am, dude. Hopefully there's some respect on that name, you know. All right, so yeah, we want that next. Carino definitely deserves the bullying. Yeah, they're pretty villainous with their power. Um, all right, processing plant. Do you need us? We Dude, those machine gunners are so so powerful. That composition, um, Cerberus. Yeah, yeah, the machine gunner spam. Yeah, it's pretty mm -hmm. good. What what's that for? Who? Uh, it, it basically, um, the demolisher units, you can give the machine gunners an armor breaking, so they just, like, shred armor. It's pretty nuts. Anything for you, Baron. Anything for you, Baron. All right, Hadri's coming to have some fun here, I see. What are you, what are you doing? Get out of here, dude. Get out of here with this. What is this? You always just kill my armies with operations. You don't even need to. Well, that's like, literally how the Harkonnen's supposed to play. It's like they're they get cheap operations. They're about schemes. I thought you and Pone were having fun. Are they about? Uh, Carino's hey, actually hey, still. Oh, hey Pone, he smashed. Pone, do you know what would be really funny? If we both if we put both of the controlled markets on Harkonnen. <laughs> oh, there's. You're absolutely right. There's two controlled markets. That's pretty just funny. I, I would just, I would probably have to bank my chum. Oh, Judge of the Council. Okay, let's decline that. The problem uh, is Carino is still going up with that double one on the bottom. They uh, have the, oh, the white plane in the bottom. Oh, yeah, they're doing double. Uh, I would keep pushing, but I have to be careful with you attacking me now. I mean, if it makes you feel better, I don't plan to go further than the... Uh, Spaceship. Well, I already have enough to rebuild multiple ships. Yeah. yeah. So if you what he would kill, like to say, but he lots. doesn't kill him. I'm, I'm going. Let's kill see what happens. Him. He's just gonna nuke me. You know <laughs> it's gonna. You know it's gonna happen. Yeah, he's just gonna keep popping the worm. Well, the worm is like free for me basically now because of the. Uh, well, I have to. I've, I haven't sacrificed enough agents for it. Wait, actually. that's that's probably. There's no counter to that. Well, it's not free. It's like a hundred something. Uh -huh. Okay, looks good. Yeah, there's no counter to that. Jeez. Let's do this. Okay. How's that looking? It is time. Let the Nurglings feast. God, I wish I could buy chum shares, but I'm just in the pits politically, so I can't. Who's going to get judge of the council? Oh, how come only Carino and Atreides are available? Oh, because I can't vote on myself? Is that what it is? Okay. What do you need? I don't know. I assume the land strat just doesn't think of you as a, like, thing that exists. Yeah, you're not a threat. They just, like, they just look at me as a potato. Go, go, missile turret. Does the... Does the monument not have a base attack? No, oh, I think it's just a buff. It's not that good. Yeah, it's not bad. It's... Okay, let's do that. Here comes the sun. Do, 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 do. Here comes Hadri's and I said toxic vapors. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> and combat drugs! Evil Harkonnen. Go. Uh oh, the the fog of the gods. I don't even know what it does, but let's let's uh, watch out. Go evil or go in I have no control. I I have legit no idea what's happening right now. I'm hoping it's to my benefit. But I can't I can't even tell. I, I I think it's going well for you though. Go my goblins. Yes. Yeah, those little ships I hate the most. And they actually do real damage. You'd think they'd be kind of like a joke. Well, you played StarCraft. But... You know how good carriers are. Yeah. It's the same thing. They're, they're very good. What the hell is this going on in my base? Oh my god, there's so many, like, actions going on. Like, that's the thing. You can do... Okay, you know what? This this really sucks. Attacking Harkonnen is the worst. <laughs> I'm not I'm not the scariest threat per se. I mean I'm in. You good... are the scariest threat. Nobody can attack you. You're invincible. No, no, not the scariest. 
Be, be gone. Go back to your gardens. <laughs> Are Conan Nuke ready? How does he know? It pops up in the top. Oh, really? When a, when a nuke's ready. Yep. Like, yeah, turns just plain old invincible. So I, I'm not going to win if I nuke, though. It's like That's like only if I'm really like on the back foot am I going to nuke one of you guys. Yeah, I love it. We have carriers. We have stim packs. We have all the cool shit from StarCraft. Hell yeah. What does this do? Rax is butchers. Okay. Okay, awesome. Need to rebuild my uh, my banks of militia. Because for some godforsaken reason, they've been sent back to the pits. Dude, I love that I can nuke, though. It brings me such joy. Um, all right. Nothing here. Hey, we're getting close to getting back in the Landsrad standing, boys. The time of heroes is upon us. We can't have that. <laughs> I've literally been just in the absolute dump with the Landsrad the whole game, dude. Just. Hey, Pwn, can you attack Turin so he's not the only one? We're literally tied. Pwn and I have the exact same score. Yeah, so he should be attacking you. Good. Or you could just well, take... I just offered you a peace treaty and you said no. Oh my god, evil. I don't want a peace treaty with you. See? Well, now I'm afraid. <laughs> you're trying to get him to do shit for you and you're like, no, I don't want to be your friend. Screw you, dude. All right, let's get some troopers. Fine. Peace? And you're just like, fuck you, Pwn. I'm like, ugh. Oh, Filthy. It's important to you. I am weak. The Queen of Blades, I know. We're, we're basically StarCraft here. Um, looking good. Yeah, chilling out, guys. The king has need of us. The king has need of us. Let's see how this looks. Oh, oh hey, by the way, start. with all of Hadri's scheming here, he has 30% of the chum shares. Just putting that out there. <laughs> just, just a little warning. No wonder his army is fighting well. I was wondering. I was like, why is it trading with me? Okay. Oh, all right. Well, that ex that explains that. Uh, you have a lot of the stacking buffs. But yeah. I have some. I have some. Okay, what does the siege do? Do this. Do that. I wish I could get some lands rad standing. But, um, you know, it's just going to have to come. My kingdom for a standing. I know, I literally, I don't think I have any way of getting it. Sometimes these little things on the battlefield will give it to you. Like like some Lost Relic or something. Um, yeah, yeah, that's a good one. It's pretty decent. By the way, I didn't check. Did uh, you get hit with the spice uh, controls? Yeah, I got hit with one of them, yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, that's funny. <laughs> uh, cornering the market from the shadows. <laughs> yeah, We're, we we have good money, but we I mean it's eleven thousand for us to buy a share because of our because uh, of our uh, nonsense. So, Karina might. Oh yeah, it's a lot to uh, buy shares, right? Yeah, it is. Where is that thing? There it is. Stop it. Oh, that's right. I need to put ten votes into this so I can get some lands rad standing. Just a little bit of lanes, Chad. Okay, perfect. Stop it. I'm I'm currently being oppressed a little bit myself. I have no or way to not. expand. I have no way to expand further, so I don't have any way to. Um, the oppressor. Yeah, currently, Pone and Hadri's both have governor on the table. Uh, Carino's a little bit weaker. Um, after I beat down a couple of their territories, uh, I screwed up with my 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 shares thing. But we got we got some funny schemes. What do you need? Hmm. Let's see what the politics look like here overall. Perfect. We'll so we'll keep him for a brainwashing operation. We may have to nuke. We may have to just start chain nuking here, which I don't even know what that will do per se, but it's gonna be funny either way. What the hell is this? How'd that happen? That's weird. Must have been some renegades. We destroyed the Carino base earlier, which was very funny. Um, Carino is catching up on Hedge, though. That double uh, craft workshop, and that's so far away. Do we oh, Hadri's got governorship. Hadri's got okay. governorship. Okay. Damn, I pumped a lot into that. Time to kill him. But I did not pump that much. Time to kill him, I guess. 
<laughs> Damn Although, it, Hadris! I'm you, like hovering right over Turn's base right now to attack him. You should attack him. I would I, have, but you, you should. But now, <laughs> you forced a far more imminent. <laughs> Let the nukes feast! Yeah, baby! Let's go! Oh, Dune in time. I voted. You guys want to know the evil secret? I voted for Hadri, so then we would all attack him instead of me. Yeah, that would be it. Uh, Turin's main, I, like... I was like, Turin, I put 306. Turin <laughs> knows that he's going to beat Pwn in, in a 1v1, so he just needs to get me into the pits or kill me. Well, your play. odds of holding here are good. This is a risky gambit. This is truly a Baron Harkonnen play. It's like, just wild. Oh, yeah, and... your, your play could be your downfall. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> it's possible, but oh. I don't know. We'll see, dog. We'll see. A little tricky. I don't even know where your main base is. Where is it? What the hell? Oh, foliage. Okay, there it is. Oh, God. Yeah, Carino's getting up there in the old Hegemony race. Yeah. He's winning it now. He's going the distance. <laughs> this is getting real chaotic, though. All right, Pwn, you better be attacking, dog. Uh, I'm flying there. It's not a very fast machine. Wait, why am I in... Okay, yeah. So turn killed me by making me gov. LOL. Well, we'll see about that. Oh, God, I lose 100 Landsrad standing for that shit. That's so wild. Yeah. Yeah. Is the worm going to get me here? Or am I going to get to the terrain? Okay. <laughs> Adrian's random ass spaceship just there. All right. We, the, we Harkonnens are uh, a mountainous people. Is that right? Oh god. Yes! The yes! Falling. Evil! Epic miss. No, it hit. <laughs> well, you hit, the, you hit the city. <laughs> it's just there to send a message. Holy shit. Okay, I need to do this quickly. Oh, uh, supply drop. Yes. Okay, good. Do that. I'm hitting the main base. I'm doing what I can. Yes, good. Good. Prepare another nuke, Baron. <laughs> we have money. Time to dump it. Yeah. <laughs> that was a glorious nuke for sure. I got the main base down to like half. Well, a little bit worse oh, than that. I see it. Now you gotta come over and do your thing. The Baron will be back, dude. Baron. You guys wanted this. It's gonna tank my odds of winning because I won't be able to... Yeah, but it doesn't... Jesus. Yeah, okay. I just lose because... <laughs> the scheme. Is Pwn attacking or what? Karina better oh, be helping flying. too. Lazy old Karina. Karina's been launching missile strikes. Orbital on my strikes. Entire army. Or, yeah, he's been spamming orbital strikes on me the entire time. What a Chad, dude. He's just going out on a shield. The funny here. thing is, like, loss of rights is coming up, so. Like, this could you, all be for nothing. Mm, we'll have to, to see. Uh, sleeper agents and decoy thunder. All right. That is the full Monty of what we want. Do this. Um, oh, th why am I getting chum support? I can't. I, j I legit am out of the chum game now. You know what's going to be really funny is if you end up dying. Let's see. Yeah, Karino and I would. I, I die and you get the cheap chum. We get some chum and shares. Karino's not attacking me, I don't think. Oh, I need to secure that. Oh, that makes sense. Pone, do something. <laughs> He's trying. I was like, why can't I take this? <laughs> it's, a, it's a sanctuary. Yes. Uh, I was like, ah, that, yes. I clicked on it. That's the definition that of... Uh... Let me forsake your sanctuary. You guys ready for my loss of rights vote? Let's see how many votes I have. Oh, I had some banked up. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> only, yeah, on, only 90, though. Like, it's not going to matter. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah, that's right. Mercs. Yeah, I can do Mercs, too. No, wait. I don't know if I can do Mercs since I'm... Since I'm, I need to save my money, guys, because I'm like, I'm an atomics master now, so it's uh, it's a little scary. 
If you vote loss of rights, I'll stop attacking Hadri's and I'll go deal with Karina. Yeah, I, of course I voted loss of rights. <laughs> if Hadri's actually loses it, though, is the question. Oh, of course. We'll see. Until then, I have to keep running with my army and scheming. Okay, let's get you. Get some of these guys. Perfect. And uh, let's get the militia back in there. Dude, I love the atomics. It's so funny. How come my exchange rate is still respectable? Huh, it's weird. I oh, forgot to bring you back. Okay, what's it going to be? Yeah, this region here. Got a little bit of time to work with. This is a battle of epic proportions. You guys I are actually ha don't know what's happening. I don't know who's winning. I feel like you might be, but... I'm lagging, so on my screen all of the units are standing still doing nothing and turns coming <laughs> to kill me. Like, it's... it's fucked. And hey, what do you know? My prediction! I'm so smart. Shai Halud turn might save Pone, you, though. Turn and Pwn are uh, 2v1-ing me. This has never happened before, ever. So it's your fault for being good, every dude. You voted me. You could have. You could have. Uh, you could have voted. Well, actually, I had no lands red, so yeah. that wasn't gonna happen. But let's see that. Am I winning this fight? I think I am. It's possible my units are actually ignoring yours and standing still. I don't know because, yeah. Uh huh. Holy shit! No, that's exactly what was happening. My units were standing still and ignoring you. Um. Oh yeah. Now now I'm losing. <laughs> like. Jeez, man. And yeah, turn kills my base for free because every time we play, this is what happens. <laughs> embrace every it. Time. Yeah, embrace this. Everything. You'll have your chance at revenge in the grand finals, dude. Yeah, because Pwn won't be there to be your minion. No. That's true. Alright, so now we gotta deal with fuck you or GG. Karina. GG, dog. GG. Oh, dude, I get to. Dude, I actually get to nuke here and it's like not an issue. Kind of working. Because you gave up on politics. Yeah, I'm like liking this evil Harkonnen <laughs> Atomics man. Okay, so heading to. Atomics man, take me by the hand. Okay, let's do that. And let's get this going. And this. Okay, let's do that just to be safe. The Baron has to be cunning after all. All right. Now, Atreides, you need to uh, team up with uh, Turin to kill Carino, and then he kills you. What? We'll see about. I mean, he could just win Gov and then potentially take it from there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, absolutely. We'll see. There's always a chance. I mean, I have no votes. It can happen. You have unlimited operations. Oh, uh, not. A, I only have 152. I used a lot against you, actually. I was using the big expensive ones there. Okay, hopefully that holds, this holds, this holds. The thing is, Carino can hold on to that uh, one hedge zone. Yeah, it'll buy them time, uh, but if you take... T they don't have that much, dude. They're like, they're pretty much in the pits. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you can just roll up on their base and kill them. We're, we're gonna try. Okay, what do we got? Another brainwashed agent? Hell yeah. Dude, that... Yeah, this agent spam stuff is really... Okay. Actually, Karino's army's looking solid enough. Well, we'll see. I don't know. My army's pretty good, too. The supply is a bit of a problem here. Oh, yeah. I'm salty as hell. Every single time we play, it's it's <laughs> this. It, without fail. You flew too close. I think to it's a bit sun. of an exaggeration, but... I was forced too close to the sun. I had nothing to do with my own downfall. Okay. You could have just sat in your base and never expanded. I could have just never expanded, <laughs> you're correct. And then we would have never have had a reason to attack you. Okay, no, so these guys, these anyway. guys, and these guys, perfect. <laughs> oh, you got so many agents, that's really cool. Yeah, I like the Harkonnen style of uh, operation management. Yeah, it's really good. It's 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 different though. I'm not used to it. It's uh it's a whole new beast. Ready, 
Okay, let's have you guys hold position here. Kronos is on its way. Um, could do that. That would be very funny. Ready, oh, damn storms are screwing up all my transports. They know, man. The storms are... Uh... They know too much. Let's liberate that. It's probably going to take not quite as long. Um, oh, he only has one tank. Imagine if he had... Well, he got beat up pretty bad earlier, dude. It was it was yeah. it was a rough one for him. Oh God! <laughs> I think I think your nuke on me killed maybe one. Guy. It, it got like one or two guys. Yeah. Oh, is it gonna get Kronos? Does it kill it? If it, yeah. If it gets <laughs> it's just it's like so haggard. I can just keep spamming them. I'm so rich. I think the ships are actually slow enough, except for the Fremen one, where they can't get away. It just obliterated the territory. <laughs> Poe, are you attacking, or, or...? No. Yeah, let's see if the Kronos is slow enough to... Actually, Pone... I guess Pone should attack Karina. Yeah, I mean, if he doesn't, he's gonna lose the hedge, though. It's his time. Lose the edge if it's too slow, but... That's kind of Karina's only hope, and it's not gonna be enough. Alright. Well, maybe. I don't know. I'm, I'm trying, but their defenses are stalwart, so... Mm. Okay, so let's get back. And, uh... Yeah, we gotta, we gotta start partying here. Take that. Uh, let's go up here and grab that. Is he attacking me for real? All right then, sounds good. Let's do it. Drag this down. So another one bites the dust. Cool machine guns doing their job. Kronos is deep in enemy territory here. Need to go spend some of that authority. Oh, interesting, I can't capture it after I've nuked it. Okay, lesson learned. So after I nuke a territory, I actually can't capture it. Yeah, it gets the devastated. Yeah. Okay, so you don't want to do that if you're in that situation, obviously. We'll go elsewhere. Okay, let's do this. Of course, the rebellion appears at the opportune time. Take that. Land chat is there. Oh, I can actually buy a chome share still? That's weird. The chome, I guess, doesn't. All of my chome shares. The chome doesn't care about nuclear atomics. I suppose they're just like you know, your money is good with us. No matter, no matter where yeah. you're from, we ain't discriminating. Yeah, you don't get votes anymore, so. No, I get some. I have, I have I very little. Pone, Pone does have a way to win since he's speaker, right? Yeah. You did keep speaker, didn't you, Pone? I think loss of rights went off and nailed it. Yeah. Oh. Well then. Okay, let's do that. Grab this. Unassigned agent. Uh, let's just put you in spacing guild. Why the hell not? And then this needs to be that here. And yeah, we need to go ahead and do this. All right. The turn is your only win con domination. Actually, yeah, killing the other guys. Yes. It seems like the only way. It's pretty fun though. I, honestly, this is a really refreshing way to play because it's uh, usually you're just you know. One of two ways, but it's fun. I can still do chome, actually. It's true. You've got a good bank. Yeah, not that good though, because yeah, three hundred percent chome buying price because of Landsrad Pariah. So, uh, okay, yeah, so no, it's actually yeah. So I'm basically just a potato, and uh, Pwn Pwn will probably have good chances. We'll have to see. Uh. It's funny, I can still kind of buy chum shares here, which is really hilarious. Karino's main Imperial base is over there. Karino's going to be financially in the pits. Pone's probably not even helping me. Pone shouldn't be. Oh, he is. He's in the bottom corner, actually. Well, it behooves him, because if he can take the hegemony sites, like, he's going to be cackling pretty hard. Let's see a probe set up here. I haven't done one of those in a while. Uh... Have any brainwashed agents to throw in there? 
Karina just needs to defend the those white planes with the craft workshops. And... House Harkonnen, I'm watching in case you try and drop a nuke here. Oh, <laughs> you don't know how bad I wanted to, bro. My mouse was sitting over that button with an erection. I, I see the scanner. I'm I'm ready to load up and just run. Oh god, you don't know how bad I want it. Oh, it has to happen. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna get away, but it'll kill those hedge workshops, which is fine. <laughs> and more importantly, he like won't oh, the, so... uh, like, <laughs> yeah, I can't cap it now. It's fine. I, it lost its hedge workshops, and I just decapped like two things. Yeah. God, that was funny, dude. I love it. I love using these nukes. It's so fun. Don't worry, it's fine. Oh god, it's hilarious. Oh, and you don't need to go anywhere. You what do you mean? Chill. Oh, just sit here in the nuclear ra radiation. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so let's grab you guys, do this. You guys want it. It's actually good for you. The nukes are what? The spice of life in this game. There it was, everybody! He <laughs> nuked- Oh wow, look at Chad. It's a do it, do it, do it, do it. <laughs> <laughs> just pure evil, uh, bro. The thing is, the Landstrad has had enough of turn shit in his The Landstrad hates me anyways, dude. Screw him. Yeah, I'm not even... Sending. Yeah, I've accepted my fate, dude. What the hell is this probe set up? Yeah, my god. Rebellions. Rebellions everywhere. <laughs> Yuck. Okay, let's get you guys down here. Need to build militia. I guess they didn't finish or some shit? I don't know. Since when am I militia losing? This is now, weird. technically, he's still... Is it possible that Pariah comes with some, like, uh... No, it's just suffering, dude. No. My main base gets targeted by Landsrad guards. It's just, like... What do you need? Yeah, it's just everything. It's just pure suffering. All right. Looks good. Got to rebuild the militia there. Just keep nuking, man. I'm gonna. Just... No, nothing... We're all in on... I mean, obviously, it's not gonna win me the game, but I don't think it will. I mean, I could be wrong. But um, my plan is just to just go bananas with the nukes this game. Well, because if we land one really good one, it's worth everything, you know. Yeah. Uh huh. Max Van Gem is still in this though. You didn't actually take the white planes from him, and he can rebuild the craft workshop. So. Yeah, I'll just nuke it again. It's fine. He's <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I will okay. just end it. Very good. All right, so what do we got? Troop inventories, loss of rights. Uh, huh. Looking good, looking good. Uh, Sir Vamba, you don't need to worry about like any kind of stream sniping on Turin's like channel. He has a delay that's for me. It's actually an even bigger delay than it like is for everyone else. I, I feel like my delay on Turin's stream was like three minutes at least. Do you use pop out chat or do you just shame? Bro, I I can't believe you would even ask if I stream snipe. <laughs> the answer is I, I'm disappointed that you would even think that I, I was. <laughs> oh god, there's uh, the... We're coming uh, for uh, you. The Baron. The girth. <laughs> the crushing girth is on its way. Look how huge Pone is. Whoa. Thanks, man. Dude, that's quite kind of confident. I have been just, working on it. He just expanded <laughs> into the middle. He has indeed. Uh, how are we doing on manpower? Probably fine. I don't need that. Okay, well, let's go to the next base. Are we in like some sort of an alliance or something? No. Is Ceasefire everywhere or just that one spot? I think it's just the one no, spot. No, Ceasefire is on the territory that it's placed on. Like that. There you go. Mm, sounds good. So if you want to, you can just run past it and go to the other place. Take that later. Okay. Wait, I don't actually think Pone can beat your army, so. You might be able to. Got a pretty good army. Yeah. You never know, man. You never know. It's getting real shady up in here. Yeah, Alright, cool, cool. I do wish. Like, the EECAS pink fog is cute, but I do wish they had something like a uh, ceasefire, like Atreides. I don't even know what tech I'm researching. <laughs> All right, how are we looking? <laughs> why did why did the Carino just do a missile strike in the middle? 
He's How trying to you, uh... send support to you. Oh, uh, look, no, he was trying to nuke my army while it was there, dude. Pone, did you build craft workshops? Did I build what? Craft workshops for the hedge? Uh, no. Can I build nah. them? Yeah, everybody Yeah, can. you could if you research oh. them and uh, build them, you'd be getting passive hedge. Okay, well, I don't think this is going to go great. My guys are already super damaged. Oh, there comes a time every man's life when he's got a nuke. <laughs> All right, boys. You get your whole army in the Kraken? That's impressive. Yeah, it's, I think it's 10 units. Okay. Do this, do that. A um, lot of little things I should be doing. Like this, for example. Oh, damn, no. Fun is wiping you. Yeah, I didn't have much there. He just karate shot what I had. My poor overlord's going to pay the troll toll probably, too. I hope so. I hate that thing. It's not even the best. It's not even the best ship, dude. It's like I think the smuggler one is nah, way better. It doesn't mean that he doesn't hate it. He can still yeah, hate it. Doesn't it. mean that I don't hate it. The... Uh huh. Because it's the. I feel like it's one of the trolliest one. Maybe not as troll as the wraith, but. All right. So what do we have left here? Not enough. Evil pwn. Oh, watch wrong button. Army die to uh, poison fog. Yeah, does supplies help with that? No. I drop supplies. No. The supply helps with the smuggler version. Uh, nothing really helps against Harkonnen chemical weapons, except being mechanical. I think it only does damage to uh, uh, biological units, not mechanical ones. Okay. Okay. How? Oh, you could load up. Load how's up Karina your army attacking into... me? Load up your army into the Kraken, and then they won't take any damage from. At least you don't have 500 Landsrad yeah, guards beating on your base, dude. It's the worst. All right, so let's send a little uh, peace and love down here. <laughs> Might as well, right? I mean, shit. Yes. Holy shit! Oh my god, guys, he's not gonna see it. Oh, the nuke! Let's go! Let's go! Come on! Oh. Your drones. <laughs> oh yeah! Yeah, yeah baby! <laughs> Let's go! Bro, we just nuked the shit out of the Karina. <laughs> oh, yeah. Let's get another one. Wind it on up, baby! And that kills his uh, hegemony buildings, too, so that's good. Nice, oh, I nice, love it. It's so nice. evil. It's so freaking evil, dude. It's everything you wanted it to be. Oh, shit. It only flew over a couple units. Oh, that's not good. Yeah. I feel like the radius on the nukes could be a little bigger. They're, yeah, they, they're definitely really bad now. They're, they're tiny. That was weird. Tiny nuke. You're firing Fallout mini nukes. What was that appreciative? I, uh, but yeah, the, the thing I learned or figured out from uh, the poison gas is your drone units, like your, yeah, they're able to. Uh, it's just time pwn. Uh, I ain't gotta fight. Let there be a reckoning. There's oh, Jern's got a giant army. It's decent. I also yeah. have a pretty, pretty fat army. Yeah, but yours is damaged. That's true. And yeah. yeah. So is mine, though. That's so what I'm... I mean. Taking land off Harkonnen is just a non-starter. It's, like... it's, it's harder. Yeah, it's hard. Yeah. These damn rebellions are so weird. I don't Especially even know. if you make the mistake of using units. I don't even know what the hell is is these rebellions are coming from. They're coming from you. You're the Harkonnen. No, they're not like those ones. It's like it's like evil. It's different ones. It's some some weird outside rebellion. Yeah. Oh wait, what's your authority like? If you're in negative authority, you start getting. No, I'm good on authority. Okay, what's coming up here? Is it governorship, loss of rights? Oh, wow, those are actually like pretty good ones. I wonder if I can ever escape the pariah status. Not You've been nuking someone every few minutes. No, I, I was curious if it's possible. Oh. In uh, general. Is, I think it's possible in general, but not... Uh... Yeah, not in the traditional sense. 
Okay. Yeah, if you want to win, you got to be getting crap workshops. Or Doomgov, I guess. But Yeah, Doomgov works too. I don't think I have that many special regions. I have like one. I'm just now getting the tech. For craft workshops, yeah. That's what I mean. I... Uh, is there some weird... Yeah, troop inventories is on, so as soon as that wears off, the armies are going to be smaller. Okay. Master. Master of Puppets is pulling the strings. You are the master your of puppets. Smashing your dreams. There's... God, that song is so good, man. All right, cool. So we are chilling. Like a villain. We're gonna do a little something, something soon. I don't know what. I gotta, I gotta have some big schemes against the old pwn dog here. He's Carino could also creep up on us. Um, I'm actually not. I haven't looked at the chome shares in a long time. I can't even buy them, so I'm just like. Okay, nobody's pwn. If you're super nobody's rich, close to one you... of those. Well, except on head. I am. I am super rich. Yeah, and then you could get chum shares at least to thirty percent so to buff your army. That's true. Yeah, but not to win to get to thirty percent nope. of the army buff. Now that we're here, so far away. <laughs> You're kind of a little close there, homie. Oh yeah, oh. let's go. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Oh yeah. Dude, that wiped both inevitable. my bases. I know. That's why I did it. To plow your two bases. You can, you can, you can actually can. tag. Okay, so maybe that's like the better use of the nuke, tagging two like territories. From oh, the that was that felt so good, fun. You have no idea. That was like it happened. That was you everything I ever wanted from a nuke. <laughs> Just the perfection. <laughs> he did the thing. My little rat overlord is like chasing your your guys. It's pretty funny. All right, so let's get the probably yes is probably fine. There's like some ecas leftovers here which I can't mess with, which is pretty funny. I existed. You did once upon a time. Carino's moving around trolling. Um, what else do we want to do here? See, Pwn, this is what happens to all of Harkonnen minions. Let's see. <laughs> okay, let's set you up. To be fair, I mean, you had governorship, dude, so, like, if we don't team oh, you... Oh, yeah, gonna... yeah, I was, uh, I was really threatening. You were as governor, yeah. Like, that's the thing, you know? You you got voted gov, so you're, you're priority number one. You so have you to have be. to die. Yeah. Okay, let's do this. Um, phone has surrendered. No, he's 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 around. He's keeping his troops safe. Our belly is full of stings. Are they not all inside the ship? Pone's really close to winning, though, dude. Look at the look at the hegemony score. If I don't that decap this, good. yeah, Pone, like, if you just take uh take a land right now, you win. Yeah, take any territory. Got to decap him. The nuclear fallout here. How long is that? Oh, it's it's irradiated. Oh god, he's so close. Oh man, and Carino's creeping up too. It's so good. I love it. It is perfect. Okay, Trades has been slowed. Oh, I forgot I had my worm there. It would have been the classic play of walking into my own worm's mouth. It's my my signature play in this game. Oh. Let's see here. What else do we want to do? Probably that top space is just where we go next. Oh, um, yeah. I'm going to send... Phone, I'm sending you... Good vibes. Yeah, thoughts? Are you sending you some thoughts and prayers over there? Yeah, I'm sending you a secret tech message about Atreides. Okay, Pwn's blimp ship is, is there. Can my base is literally dying to the lands red guard as we speak. <laughs> I'm gonna have to like nuke it to just have a chance. All right, let's do that. Let's do this. A little bit of this for good measure. 
and uh, see what the hell happens here. I think it's going all right. It's hard to. It's hard. My main base did is under attack. My, uh, did you see my message, Pone? I think he's in the uh, heat of combat right now, dude. Yeah. Try, no, trying to not. You're not to, gonna uh, win that combat, so just get out of it. But true. But I was hoping to stall. Yes. Oh, Carino with the sneaky one. <laughs> How did they jump up so hard? Shit, they were down. They weren't even at the top there. I warned you about so, the head. I do not even care. It was fun nuking this game. I just nuked him again, by the way. <laughs> Pwn, we must unite. I will leave this base. Yeah? Yeah. You go we, away. We'll get there in time. Watch. Uh, every time Carino cackles. Oh, it's all good. That was fun though. I, I felt like I got to test yeah. the limits of the uh, of the nukes this game. Obviously, I could have probably taken some legendary sites for the dub. We should have done that. There was a bunch of free ones up here. Uh, all right, let's uh, ship down here. Perhaps not as free as you thought. No, there's a couple up north. Like, oh, but yeah, you've you've oh, you're doing the remote annexing, which is really cool. Uh, oh, the sleeper agents are still count as capturing on your territories. The Lord of Nukes. Okay. okay. Alright. The pathing here, not the best. But it's trying its best. Pwn's still sitting pretty happy on the hedge department. Uh, judge of the council would be... No, man. Okay. You would have killed the Emperor when you had the chance. It's perfect. It's, it's very, very lore accurate. Now he's ascendant. It's very low oh, he's, get, he's gonna win. Get the achievement. Empire Strikes Back for winning a game when your uh, one of your bases was destroyed. That's very cool. It's pretty great. Yeah, he was at a point where we could have killed him, but everyone kind of popped up as a threat at one point. Max Ben should have probably been assassinating him. That would have been very easy to do. Mm, yeah. I had I have all the intel and resources for assassinations, but the Emperor's kind of a hard one to do that too because he um. Yeah, because he's, he's a big scheming, you know? Big scheming. Pwn, this is your time to rise. And and step in and... I tried to do the... Either, either Pwn or Carino, if you can take... It's... Jeez, it's so close. Yeah, this is a great one. Oh, look at them, they're within... I'm just the troll, dude. I'm just the rat. <laughs> I just got a nuke again, dude. I think this okay, is my favorite thing. Nuke something, anything. I will, I will. I nuked his uh, hege hegemony buildings. He would have won if I didn't do that. Yeah, L yeah, that's... Little does Pwn know that, you know, I, I've been his true ally all along. Yet he forsakes me. Treats me like trash. Uh, Alright, so let's get this. Let's get this. Don't know, honestly, I have no idea how the troopers are doing here. The nukes uh, who have been empowering Pwn the whole time. The nukes. Oh, the uh, I won judge of the council because of the minor house. Nobody else voted for it at all. <laughs> I didn't put anything into that. The minor houses voted for you? Yeah, I won it. Oh, I'm so close to decapping this dude. It's tight. It's really close. It's really close. I think he's going to get to pay the spice tax before, though. Uh, Pwn, you got to get something. I'm trying. I got, I'm, I'm, I'm using my peaceful annexation. It's so slow. Anymore. I should have been having these guys doing their thing. Uh, let's bring them down here, bring them down here. Oh god, I'm so close to decapping this site. My base way over there, my Carino got blown he's up. closer, he's within a hundred hedge. Nuke them! <laughs> oh god, I'm at like 90%. I'm dropping a nuke. I don't know if it'll help, but I'm doing it. <laughs> Round two, baby. Oh, oh, GG. Oh, that was such a good GG. game. Oh, I'm just gonna... I, I thought I had it. Me too, dude. That was a great game. I, I try. I was trying to do the peaceful, uh, like when you backed off for a second. I was like, I got a chance, force a peace treaty, and oh. I, I didn't have enough uh, influence, influence to do it. Yeah. I was like, oh, I got wrecked. You were I was, you were close to winning. I kept sniping those hegemony territories that were up in Hadri's area. So you were living it up, dude. Uh, GG. So, GGs. So you, you guys playing again? Or you got a jam? How you feeling? I'm not going to play again. No worries, Doug. How about I, you, Hades? Hey, you done? Let me see. We, I'm going to be playing more yeah. later tonight, too, so. I can do another quick game. All right, sounds good. So that means he must die. 
I'm well, gonna. Be I'm actually gonna so. keep practicing this playstyle. Um, all right, guys, I'm making a game called Turn Game. Anybody's welcome to join. So this time I'll actually. Oh, oh, okay, perfect. Um, I won't troll as much with the nukes. I will still maybe use them, but I'm gonna try and play Chome and stuff because I, I really set myself back. Granted, we could have won that game if I played a little smarter. Um, so yeah, dude, this agent's so good, Peter. Wow, he's great. Yeah, Peter's really strong. He is. He is. All right. Perfect. So for this game, I'm going to uh, jump off mic so I can talk my tactics and stuff and explain without spoiling. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Sounds good. GG, lads. It was really fun. Jeez. That was an amazing game, and hopefully you guys enjoyed all the nuking because I had so much fun. Um, we're going to do one more Harkonnen game, and then I'll close out with a, uh, with a non-Harkonnen game. Yeah, I could have assassinated. I could have done like 10 different things. I just got, I just got lazy, and honestly, I got a little excited. With the nukes, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I got a little excited on that. All right, ready up. Ready up. So Hadri's is, uh, we got old Wookiee, we got Carino and myself on Harkonnen here. But this time we'll play, we won't tank our lands rad sanding immediately. We'll do smarter things. We nuked Pwn like three times, dude. One of them was perfect. We actually nailed this whole army there too. God, nuking between cities is really strong too. I, I, I didn't think of that. Like you could obliterate somebody's empire. Um, Hadri's on smuggler, sweet. So what I'm thinking is, we we nuke between cities and just wipe out people's territories. If we have like twenty thousand gold, we could build four nukes and just obliterate somebody's like bases, like all their production and everything. Man, uh, all the schemes are clicking. Okay, the, I've gotten the Harkonnen bug once again. Yeah, how many nukes did we have that game? Like seven or eight, maybe? It, my base was like at half health too, though. The Landsrad Guard, the cackling laughter while launching nukes was the highlight of my day, dude. I, I am going to play in the grand... So I'm in the grand finals of this tournament, right? And uh, for Dune. And I'm going to be nuking nonstop. I don't, I'm just going out of my shield. It's going to be so fun. Yeah, Pone was almost one. He was really close. If we didn't get that last base from him, he would have uh, had us in the bag. That that last nuke was good, though. The last one was good. Yeah. That was a money one. All right. But let's actually like play smart here and try and win instead of just cackling and being evil, as much fun as that is. All right, everyone loaded in. Yeah, I needed to be more aggressive on villages. Yeah. Okay, so he's in, he's in, he's in. All right, everybody's good to go. Let's queue these bad boys up and start. Yes. All right, so pretty good little western corner spot. Good luck, have fun. We got the old Wookiee in. He was playing in our tournament. I believe it's over here. It's the dark side. I know. We were... Yeah, like I, I could have had an assassination attempt going, but Carino's really good at stopping assassinations. They have the special Eye of the Emperor tech, which is just nuts. Militia slot. That's actually an extra 5% production for us here, which isn't bad. It's not bad at all. Alright, let's do that. And start grabbing all the goodies. I got like 8 stream achievements. I've never won. Oh, Max Benjim, dude, you did it. Carino is... Carino is like the sieve that endures. Like, you just went on hegemony so hard because of the double craft workshops. It's, um... I do think Carino is probably the strongest in the game. They feel really good. Like, winning with them just is like so easy compared to... I mean, not to say you played extremely well. I'm not belittling it, but I, my experience playing Carino, it's like, it's very smooth. Um, let's do that and then that, like that. So space here is Intel and Solari per military building. So we'll do a little bit of pillaging on that because we don't need it too much. Um, slap a heavy militia in there and a ranged militia and build another one of these. Carino's top tier. Honestly, if you watch my recent Carino playthrough in the tournament, the, I posted it on the channel. You can um, you can see what to I, I think that was like archetypal Carino. Yeah, they're really fun. They're really fun. I love Carino, but I have to say Harkonnens might be my favorite after that last game. I I have not had that much fun fun playing Dune like nuking and then voting for Hadris to become the governor. So then we team up and kill him. That's like the most Harkonnen shit. It, it was just perfect. I loved every second of it. All right, we have the research center here, which is a nice one actually. So we're gonna go grab that. Ooh, pretty good trade too. It has the uh, agent recruit speed by 30%. Outstanding. 
The double craft plus statue. Yeah, it's nuts. It's nuts. Master. We uh we'll have an agent soon. Yes. Yes. Yeah, the the when uh, I when Max Ben Jim dropped his base next to me. So Max Ben Jim, the really cheesy tactic with the base drop that you did is to get siege drones and set them underneath it. And then you just um you snipe it. It's really annoying to deal with. Okay, so what else do we want to build in this region? Um, so we'll do that. And then we'll go for filtration systems first. I don't want to run out of water so quickly this game. And let's get some plastery. Yes. We'll Heal these guys up, then we'll go grab this. What do you need? All right, let's roll and roll and roll in. He, he is very good. I mean, Hadrius was beast moding it. He was doing very well. well but you know. Ekaz can threaten Governor really quickly, so like obviously you're gonna have to team up against political houses. Cause just taking somebody one on one is pretty hard unless you have a pretty solid lead. Alright, so that's going good. This is all fine. The agent sacrifice with the brainwash sacrificing the brainwashed agents is really powerful. I think that's um incredibly strong. This is a good base too. This one gives you 6% of the village's salary upkeep is knowledge. It's not bad. Not bad at all. There's going to be some maniacal nuking as well in this game. So don't worry. Uh, you're not going to be disappointed. So this one gives you processing plant. That's what we go for next, hands down. It's um, Processing plants are really good with Harkonnen because you can um, oppress them and then you get just crazy, crazy goodies. Usually you want to oppress all your spice fields and then any big money territories, and that's pretty much it. Yeah, local dialect is fine. That's going to be 15%. Then we can go filtration systems. It's my usual build order. And uh, we can chill here, build a research station because we have the building here, which gives us 20 salary. It basically pays for the research station, which is great. Arrakis, and uh, you want to start looking for these. These little crash shuttles, they give you free tech research when you finish them. So you always go for that. I proxied the base for the meme to start, but only a few techs in after it was clear. I was going to snipe it. It felt like, yeah. Oh, you did great, Max Ben. You were you were a survivor, dude. You you took your, your blows, but you just kept coming, man. The true champ. There's And Carino does that. Carino's really good at running like under the radar, and then you just creep up in the shadows and win on hegemony. It's um, It's very much their style. It's very much their style. You did really good, brother. You did really good. What do you need? All right. Yes, master. Let's push up. Do this. Um, that is going to finish soon. Get another heavy militia there. Clear out this. We're going to do some... We're doing heavy pillaging here, obviously. Could do some probe setups if we want to. What does this region have? Income per military building. And 40% cost reduction is a really good trait for villages that... Um, you want to build like special buildings on basically all right so we'll get a water trap down there oh that's actually a spice field oh shit i did not notice that okay it just got explored so we're just actually going to take that and get the double spice going really early um how are we looking here all's fine in the neighborhood uh this can be a plascrete and then we can do manpower after that and I think if I have one building of each type here, yeah, that gives me plus 10 from the local sourcing. Uh, so we have Carino up here, who this game will definitely show no mercy on Carino. But like last game, Hadrius had 30k. He was acting like he was weak, but it was just nonsense. He had 30k, 30% uh, chom, and was elected for governor. So he was, he needed to die. I don't, you know, no matter how much people act like, oh, I'm weak. Why'd you, why are you 2v1ing me? It's like, that was like the most obvious shit. Like, he was, he was a cackling villain, 100%. All right, so two spice fields is great. Um, and uh, yeah, we just keep rolling, rolling, doing it. What's our next step? As fast as we can. As fast as we can. All right, let's go scout that. Mm. And yes, the advanced engineering should come up soon. I'm just kind of saving our plastery for the important buildings. Yeah, Carino's nearby us. They're up on the top here, I would wager. All right, so resolve that, and then we will take this one. So you see, we just got the survival training for free, which is really good. Uh, anything here that we want? Diplomatic Congress? Definitely not. Carino is the one who would want that. Scout that out. 
And um, we're going to need a maintenance center here too, probably to hit all these regions. All right, so we need a little bit of manpower. Um, we can go raid that village, which isn't going to be that good. Oh, man. All right. So we might need to pillage that to take it away from our neighbors there so they're not so happy and comfortable. All right. Looking awesome. And this one gives you recruitment offices. What is it? Recruitment office limit, insulary per military building. Okay. So we can build another uh, military production building there and be fine. Uh, filtration systems, yep, water's coming up. Uh, it's going to be super, super important. We'll run there. A lot of nice regions. This is the one I want next. This bad boy down here is really prime time. Don't want to raid that, obviously. All right, so... Hmm. Yeah, we build the upkeep production building in the middle region here. Could build one more recruitment office. So let's just do Plascrete. It's a really nice to have Plascrete on the places that you're going to oppress. Okay, so we finished that. That's going to be free tech. And is there anything else nearby we can get? This one's going to give us intel, which isn't as useful. This one gives us military tech, which is good. All right. Do you also, Carino is my... Probably if I'm really trying to win, I play Carino. When I was playing in the tournament, I played Carino. Um, all right, 2k hedge. We just need to save up a little bit of Plascrete now, and then we should be good to party. Local dialect, which one gives me the uh, resource? Oh, I think I just start with that with Harkonnen, don't I? All right, well, anyways, let's save up here. Anything to go raid? Another spice field down to the side. We have a really nice, like, okay, I'm going to go raid this one, even though I would normally want that for myself. Um, I'm going to raid it because it's not super accessible for me. And we got great convention watchers. I didn't even vote for that for myself. Okay, that's weird. Isn't that weird? All right, down to the bottom, 100. Again, we're just going to get water traps there as soon as we finish that. Yes. Yeah, Dune Stream, baby. Yeah, Pwn was a remote annexing all the hegemony sites, which was a really, really smart play. It was, it was great. Playing like a true champ. All right, let's go raid that. Get a little bit of that money. And let's sell more spice, although the rates aren't great now, so we're going to kind of go in a bit of a middle approach just to stay positive. Blood will flow. All right, boys, let's move it on in. Get you back there. We research that. So another free military tech is done. Let's research this one. We're saving up for this special um, processing plant region because that's going to be a shit ton of money when the time comes. Agent goes here. Uh, turn in. Uh, yeah, voting for the uh, ECAS governorship was... was I, I, it was kind of like... Because him and Pwn were getting ready to turn on me. It was very obvious. You know, I was I was going to become the villain. And um, I, interestingly enough, though, I wasn't that even... I wasn't as strong as Hadri's. Hadri's had 30% chum. I had like 10. So he was still the villain, but somehow they were turning against me. So I had to like do something to stop it. Um, all right. So that's... Ooh, the Great Volcano is a pretty good one, too. So maybe we'll, we'll grab that later if we can. All right, so let's go ahead and get these Solari buildings going. Perfect. Outstanding, and the water trap should be done in a second. And then we get the oppression building after that. We get the martial economy. What do you need? Go forth, my, my evil minions. Let's get a big goon squad so we can pillage the bases quicker. All right, so filtration systems is here. We need a little bit more in that regard. Plaskery is hurting. Turn is playing the Harkonnen and the Inner Tyrant. Dude, I know. I, I love I love being a villain in games. I just like scheming. Scheming stuff is just the funniest. I don't know. I don't know what about it. it just makes me laugh, but it's just, uh, it's just how it is. Take that one. We're going to get two more troopers. Looks like this is a weird choke point here. Yeah, okay. So we see Carino. We know where we're going to run into issues. Let's go pillage this again. I might even go do some early pressure on them. So water, and who else has a good water? So six, two, and three. So neither of those regions are that good for water. We do have enough to get the processing plant now, but we're just gonna pillage this real quick. Cause it's, I'm keeping this base in the back just to kind of perpetually hit. All right, let's party. Chome shares are up, and we're not gonna buy any of those quite yet. 
Two spice fields online feels great. Let's get them fully operational. And let's pillage that. Evil politics. That's what we, we... Last game we were evil politics until the time came to just unleash the hatred. And then we, we just went pure, pure villain. We did our villain arc. 100%. All right, so heading down this way, let's go grab this. Then we're gonna need to eventually grab that. Let's heal up a little bit. Uh, no, no oppression yet, but we're gonna oppress the hell out of this region. This one gives us 31. What's the upkeep on that? 16, yeah, I guess it's not even that much of a net profit. So probably just the spice fields will be oppressed, for starters. Uh, let's bank a little bit more spice. We probably, uh eh, we're about to finish another building in our main base too. All right, let's grab that. Now we got good water. Yeah, good villains are great. Why not turn off the victory condition except killing opponents? So you have, that's not very fun. For me, I mean, maybe if you got like, I personally like the diversity of win conditions. It's what makes it very um, alluring to me. Hadrius has the big smuggler um, pillaging party, so he's just kind of running around, but we'll be prepared. We'll have our, our garrison and everything. So it shouldn't be too bad. Um, all right, so saving up here. Great convention watchers is pretty funny in case anybody tries to attack us. All right, so lose intel and minor houses. Um, that gives us some political say. Yeah, we'll take that, it's fine. We don't really need intel too much right now. Smugglers could come for us here. That would be pretty annoying for sure. Um, Diplomatic Committee, the elected faction. So, for some godforsaken reason, they voted on me last game. I don't know why. Um, but we'll decide who we want to vote on that one for in a moment. And then we need to get the heavy militia here so we can't lose a spot. And we'll be all good in the neighborhood. All right, so let's grab that. Plastic production. And let's just get heavies. And then we need to get... What does this region actually have? Per statecraft building? Okay, that's not bad. We need the processing plant though. That's where the sauce is at, 150. Ah, uh, we could just set this up. Yeah, let's see. All right, guys. So we're about to get the martial economy so we can start oppressing soon, which is how you start making the big money is the Harkonnens. Um, I have pretty good income. I probably can go grab this region. This region gives me what? Yeah, it's a little bit of a knowledge buff, which is cool. But let's get the uh, the numbers going. Yeah, let's get the let's get that, and then we'll get lay of the land to get the knowledge buff. Can grab this for the fuel cells. Is it really that pertinent? Probably just the spice field is the way here. It's pretty close to the smugglers, which I don't like. But um, Hadrius will probably be seeking vengeance from last game. But I mean, you know, it's, it happened. He, he got he got caught in the political trap. So let's grab that, keep expanding. Processing plant will come up in a second. So we got five garrison slots at that base. I don't see anybody taking that easily. Okay, looks fine, man, we are, yeah. Oh, I forgot to vote for the, yeah, so I watched. Hadri's probably spite voted me, let's see. Yeah, oh no, Carino did it. Wow, look at that, Carino, extra evil. Hadri's also voted me. So what we do at this point is we probably will stockpile, although we're probably just gonna go in the red, so we have to pillage, because we're gonna lose the development here. So we'll take this first and foremost, and then we'll leave you to capture that. We'll go up north. So unfortunately, we don't have research while this is active, so we're gonna take a bit of a blow. Let's take that. Oh my God, I hate when that happens. I told the unit to stay, but it was just like, no. All right. So why is this guy coming with the troops? He should be staying there. You literally saw me deselect him, right? It's the weirdest shit. Anyway, so we need to get back in the green because we are hurting right now. We are hurting bad. All right, so let's get you and do this and just go pillage here to get the money back. Um, do we have enough? Not at this point. And we should be able to slap some militia in there, but man, I'm tanking financially. We probably just need to stockpile the chome and just suffer for this uh, this little window of time here. And let's get a turret up, I suppose. Uh-huh, to make sure we don't get raided by the smugglers and we just go pillage that and that will hopefully get us back in it. 
All right, so that's going to finish. That will help our finances. Hopefully cleaning out that village over there will do that too. And we just got a chain chain smuggle or chain raid basically. Yes. Come on, give me the money cuz I'm missing out on tech right now for sure. This can happen with Harkonnen sometimes. 100%. All right, so let's get the office of the order. Let's pillage that. That'll put me in the green again probably. And uh yeah, we're we're maybe expanding a little bit too quickly. That could be that could be part of it. All right, so we went back in the green for a second, but then we're immediately just tanking back because they voted on the, the bad exchange rates for me, so pretty trolly. Um, this region, we want to get the maintenance center as soon as we can. That should put us there. No, Fremeter, uh, smugglers apparently pwn. A lot of people think smugglers are one of the best in the game, which I, having played them recently, I would be inclined to agree that smugglers are just like top tier. They feel very good. Unfortunately, I'm caught in a similar situation where I'm like between Carino and Smugglers. And I don't know what Ecaz is doing on the other side, old Wookie, but probably not a whole lot. Um, if we come down here, can we go in the green? Yeah, we can. Okay. Because we can't afford to be like not researching for this long. It's just really bad. Uh, we don't want to lose our whole army. He's probably going to be watching me here. So, uh-huh. Do that and that. Let's get that fully sauced out. And now we are officially in the green again. The Office of the Order will be finishing here in a second, which will uh, give us money and plascrete. And all good. Smuggler militaries are probably one of the best early militaries in the game, believe it or not. Okay, so I don't think anybody's going to want to come after that. And here we are getting the maintenance center. This is generating now, which is good. Let's get a range militia. Yes. All right, we're back in the green, baby. Um, let's see how much spice we can stockpile without going red. Because when the rates are like really shitty, then uh, you know you want to be you want to be doing that. All right, office of the order. I'm happy to not fight smugglers for a while. Let's grab this. We didn't research for a long time, so we're going to be pretty behind on tech. Okay, he's coming over here again. Looks like he wants to do battle, which is wild. I'm surprised, but you know, the hate the hate is flowing here. I did not get a chance to plunder that, but we are nearby. So if he tries for this base, I mean, we got missile turrets and pretty much everything we could want. Um, we can save up. All right, cool. So that's good. We got spying logistics. Get lay of the land next. And let's get a spice field here. If he goes for that base, it's fine. We're just going to sit here and defend. And just hang out. Um, let's go ahead and do some lands rad. So the elected faction gets Solari upkeep. So this will this will be helpful. We'll vote that for ourselves. What's our next step? He's doing like the big early smuggler blob, which is a tactic I've seen a bit. It looks pretty fun, actually. Mm-hmm. And are we defeating the rebels here? We are, which is great. And up top, let's continue building that out. Oh, he's just pillaging it. It's fine. So we're just going to stay here until he leaves. All right, so we're getting 104 from that now. We're still stockpiling. Um, the controlled markets being voted on me every single game has been an absolute blast. Let's do that. And as long as we could just like keep them at bay, they would have trouble getting through a missile turret and five militia probably, so I think we're all right. So go elsewhere now and grab some more territory. We'll grab this for now. Um, all right, so that's good. This uh, region has the upkeep production, which is outstanding. Office of the Order. We're gonna need more manpower buildings, so we need to start spamming those. Like stat. Militia, militia. And let's grab this. Cool. Uh, Thopters, I believe, do help with stealth units. They do. Yes, we have the special region here, which is giving us 100. It's not as good as what Carino can do with the village traits, but it's still very good. Um, what else do we want to build down here? Probably a water trap would be good, considering that we need more water. And, of course, we need to oppress all that. And next we get a maintenance reduction on this spot. Yeah, you got to be careful with the Office of the Order. If you go too crazy, you can run into issues with um, 
like manpower and stuff. Yeah, we're going pretty hard on the tax negotiations to get the upkeep production to try and bank for a little bit. Oh, I didn't notice that military developments were on discount right there. I should have done something about that. All right, so that will finish, and then we'll get the modular parts. Well, geothermal condensers isn't bad. We already almost have it finished. All right, let's get the fuel cells. Water's coming. Let's go raid this. Labor rights, and uh, yeah, I don't mind labor rights. It's fine. That actually hurts Hadrius the most because he has like a huge blob army already. Um, let's go get this sacred region up here. This one gives us 6% of the village's upkeep is knowledge. It's not bad. Not amazing, but not bad either. Wow, getting to us is only on the sides of the map. So if we just fortify the bottoms, we should be okay. There's like a deep desert here, although you can run through this. What do you, mean? you can run through that. Nope, should have built a manpower building here. That's right. Master. Yeah, all right, so let's move in there. Take that down. Um, we are negative on the manpower right now. Good times. Let's do this. Build a manpower building. Should get us out of the negative here in a second. And we'll be okay. Good, Anakin. Good. Let it flow. Let the hate flow. Uh, yep, we'll take that. It's going to jump us up in hegemony a little bit. The militia are coming out and farming the rebels, which is great. Get you guys over there to help out. And what's he building here? Yeah, airfield and military base. The classic defensive perimeter stuff. Unassigned agent. Let's do that. And we do have the Solari upkeep. We should be selling more spice now since the exchange rates are good. This is our chance to get rich. One Plascrete per economy building. So let's go ahead and throw some wind down there. Our manpower is negative because our troops are trying to regenerate right now, so we just need to move them away. We need to move it away. Ready for destruction. All right, looking good. Everything's stable-ish. We're not dead yet, you know. We got that going for us. We live to serve. Um, is here doing its thing, you know, growing fat and powerful. As fast as we, can. On the move. we need to move away. The accursed storms are here. Manpower building's finishing on several fronts. Um, uh, we can get a manpower building here. Definitely sets your economy back a little bit, but it's uh, it's worth. All right. Master. Master. All right, so let's go ahead and grab the modular crews so we can fill out our province for um, manpower. Although, yeah, we have the money. It's just Plasteel is, is our... We're expanding a little bit too hard, I think. You gotta love the dune storms. Always, always fun. Always setting you back a little bit. Yeah, might be. I mean, we do get money every time these rebel. It's it's one of the reasons why we're rich. All right, so we want to buy some shares. Could start buying some shares. The prices are down, and we have money sitting around. So let's let's start investing in the old uh, the old stocks here. We have that, which is reducing the cost of those buildings. We need to get that building here too. It is 400 Plascrete though, which is very steep. Listening. All right. Water Cellars Union coming up. So only ECAS is um, free for that. I like to go into spaceship mode to see if anybody's like attacking me or looking to get a little crazy. You know, it's, it's always good to do that every couple seconds. Yes. Well, maybe like 30 seconds, I don't know. Intel. Um, let's get the thumper. In case anybody wants to mess with us, we'll grab that. And uh, yeah, we'll get another main base building as soon as that's done. Our manpower is not good at the moment. Despite building quite a, quite a bit, actually. What do we want to do here? Um, we would want to get... Is this the one that has the cost reduction? It does. So we can get the airfield here. What does this special region give? Research hub? All right, let's go Let's go hit that. We're just gonna go do a little pillaging around in the middle and hope for the best. Okay, nothing there. Yeah, if we can get a bunch of pillaging value here, we should be able to get quite a bit of money. Man, six manpower is brutal. That's not very much. Um, all right, slap the base on you. And uh, we're going to want it up here, too. 
soon as we can. Oh, this is like the Acid Lakes one, though. This one's very annoying. It does damage per day to your troops. All right, Water Cellars Union. Um, I am going to just vote on myself for this. Like, I don't know. ECAS is across the map. They're not like a huge threat to me, per se. So we're gonna we're gonna play the uh, play the dice there and see. I don't have the most votes at the moment, but it's certainly something. All right, manpower, manpower. We're getting it all over the place. All right, pillage that, and we're gonna have to go back and heal. Let's just have you chill. And how did it go? Outstanding. All right, so we got a nice little pillage on that. Um, manpower. Yes, let's get some heavy militia here. Probably no... What are we not oppressing? We're not oppressing this spice field right now, which is a bit haggard. You always want to oppress the spice fields. This is the one that we might want to switch up, because, I mean, are we getting... Yeah, we are getting a bit from that spot, which is nice. You gotta love the Harkonnens. Basically, everything is just on fire 24-7. Like, all your bases are, uh, are just tough. <laughs> These are no rabble of Orakai, yeah, thick. Yeah, it's great times, man. These these are Harkonnen soldiers. Ready to die for the Baron. Uh oh. See that? I don't like that. I don't like that Hadris has a huge goon squad on my southern border. Makes me a little bit nervous. Um, alright. So this region we're gaining a little bit of knowledge. Statecraft building and plascrete per economy. Slap down to plascrete building. Hey, nice. We just got some random lands, rad punishers, and we did get the infrastructure control. That's like the money. That's what we wanted. So that is very, very good. Um, all right. So for starters, let's go ahead and get the barracks building going. So we can probably squeeze out three major buildings right now. Karina wants to trade with me. Um, no, I'm good. I'm just going to let that sit there so he feels, so he feels the rejection. Um, let's get fuel cells here. Little drones flying overhead. We'll decline that. He's probably just pillaging this again, but I just want to make sure I don't lose my border my border territory. That would be a really big setback. So that will help our manpower considerably. We need to get this region sauced up. This one looks good. It's being oppressed. Um, we really need to get the, the upkeep production one there. That would save us a ton of money. The rates are pretty good right now, the exchange rates, so we're just going to sell everything and just make as much money as we possibly can. Um, which should be good. Yeah, right here is going to just hit all these bit territories, which is just so good. Alright, so let's get the supply drop ready, and let's also get the combat drugs in case we have to fight. Hopefully we don't. Upkeep production center, nice. And let's just go get this. We don't necessarily need a lot of authority right now because we don't have too many places to expand safely. Probably going to take this processing plant here. Um, can you stack silo buffs? I believe only one. Just one, I think. I'm not sure, though. Somebody might want to clarify that. <laughs> hey, Owen. How you doing, man? Thanks for joining. Yes. We're having a good old jolly time. Infrastructure control is very good. It's very, very good. Um, we don't have enough influence to give up yet. Let's do that. Deploy. We need to get all of our bases militiaed out, if possible. Statecraft building in one Plascrete per. So let's go ahead and get a spice silo here. It'll buff our neighbor nearby territory and also trigger the buff. Alright. So pretty good. We can buy some more stonks. If we can get to 10%, that's really good because that gives us uh, extra influence. Watched his nuking opponent short. I was on the edge. It's so funny, dude. Yeah, the nuking is is, is hilarious. We did, you last game for anybody who just joined. It was just a nuclear apocalypse, basically. Yeah, it was nuts. What's our next step? Okay, what do we want to do down here? Is it being oppressed? It is not. There's a problem. Definitely needs to oppress them. Um, I think we're okay here. I think we're all right. Let's see what agent actions we have. Do we have the the toxic gas one yet? Doesn't quite look like it. Probably need to get... Yeah, we can delete this and build an airport down there. 
It's going to set us back a tiny bit, but I think it's okay. All right, so next up, oh, what tech do we want to get? Um, Spine Mastery does give us a lot of agents. We don't care about the lands rad too much, but let's go a little spice heavy. But we need an airport down there, 100%. The spice must flow. All right, cool. Looking secure. We have the upkeep production. Okay, here he is. All right. So big army coming down here. Probably going to be able to pillage our stuff, which is fine. We can't really do a whole lot about that right now. We're going to get a couple Cerberus and at least try and fight back here. Let's see if he pillages or what he decides to do. But our army's nearby. Oh, liberating. Wow, okay. That's, that's pretty heavy duty. Um, so I'm trying to think. Yeah, if we wait for more troops here, we might be able to hold... See if we can get this guy, hire them for a raid as well. We have a decent little army right here. He's destroying buildings. Yeah, and then in the main base, um, we want to go ahead and max out each home. I don't know if we could take that army, honestly. I don't. We do have the Landsrad guys. When the two Cerberus get here, we're going to try and salvage it. Which, I don't know, what does this army look like? Scavengers, smugglers, random things. Definitely has the hate boner going from last game. All right, let's get a missile turret here. Slap you down. Cerberus will be finishing at the main base here in a second. Come on. It would give us more buffering between the smugglers and us. Um, anything that we want to get here? Uh, yeah, let's take the permitted income. I have the council. Let's do the... Hmm, the War of Assassins could be pretty nice, actually. We'll take that, and then we'll put one vote into this, too. All right, no idea how this fight's going to go, but we're going to try it out. Did he cancel the Liberate thing? I don't know if I can beat his army, guys. It's pretty fat. Okay. Seems to be going all right, um, but he does have more reinforcements coming in. Let's do that, make sure we don't take supply loss. The Landsrad Punishers are trying their best, but yeah, that Smuggler early blob is really good. Holy shit. Um, we gotta just slap a turret down here, like stat. Yeah, holy shit, that army is really good early on. Let's see if we can snipe this one unit at least, get a kill there. Come on, give me the snipe. Ah, we got something. I'll take the scraps. Um, we are going to need to get, yeah, just, we just, he's just liberating it though. I don't know if we can hold this second base here. Although the executioners are going to be here soon. So maybe we're going to have to switch into military tech hundred percent. Um, missile turrets coming. We do have the Landsrad punishers. All right. So let's just drag him through here. Do this. And then see if the, the troops can hold there. But man, that is a big army guys. That is huge. We might have to just give up on the whole bottom of the map and go north. At your service. I'm thinking. I mean, a little bit of damage is being taken, but not a whole lot. Not a whole lot, to be honest. All right, so do we have the toxic vapors yet? We do not. But let's go ahead and sacrifice an agent, because we're going to need that shit. That's for sure. Uh-huh. And uh-huh. Let's get some air force. And toxic vapors, toxic vapors, toxic vapors. So let's go ahead and sacrifice some lands, rad boys. All right, so we're just going to do that to his army and hopefully be able to reclaim some of the territory here. He's doing very early aggro, which is strong. It's definitely very pressuring. Um, so we're just going to try and survive. He's just pillaging this one, so we will get this back and we can rebuild it. But yeah, hopefully his army does get beat up a little bit. Overall, we got one spice field. Um, we're in okay shape. It could have been way worse. If he was doing more than pillaging here, I would be sweating bullets, but... He's going to get wormed on the way out, too, probably. Let's see if he does. Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay. Oh, he didn't even kill any buildings. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, that wasn't that bad. Early smuggler pressure is really nasty. Really, really nasty. Uh, all right, let's cut the plane. We are not going to need it. Do we want this base? We still have two spice fields. Let's not get too greedy. Let's just go north with our big boys and start capturing some territory up by the Emperor. We can, our late game army will be probably better than smugglers, so that's when we would come back and try and get, you know, try and get our, our, uh, our business back online. 
All right, so how are we doing here? Um, do we still have the upkeep production? We do not, unfortunately. Uh, all right, let's get the agent recruit speed, which is good. Let's get you for the free military tech. This base has been punished. And let's go up north. All right, so one spice field is down. We still have the oppressed spice fields. So that's pretty good. We'll grab this site, although it is a little bit on Carino's border. Ah, oh, Carino. Let me see, who is he? Is it old Wookiee? If you send uh, non-aggro, I will take for now. I'm sent, so you can direct message people if you want to keep your like schemes in secret. It's very good, it's very good. Okay, so that missile turret is up. I would like to get rid of it and build something more useful. Stupid space field stuff trolling me here. Let's see if he sends it. I don't know if he will. You got our Fremen Raider, man. Um, do you want to do anything there? I don't think so. This is being oppressed. This is being oppressed. We need to get the manpower buildings. Smugglers probably won't. Um, no. I would like to ally with Carino temporarily, just to get the uh, the, the lands ride council. That would be pretty sweet. All right, spice some spice. And for you, what can we get up here? Mm, could get knowledge. Could get a little bit of water. Water probably wouldn't be terrible. We could get a military base too. So thwart aggression. Uh, he, we don't. He, he thinks we have a pack, but we don't. Oh, yeah, it was. Oh. Oh, I got it backwards. Okay. All right. So let's do a little bit of political scheming here because we need to reestablish ourselves. We're going for a very greedy build, so early aggression can for sure punish us. Um, let's do spacing guilds. Let's get you going, which is awesome. I don't know if Carino's gonna take it. But the smuggler armies will for sure defeat us early on. I mean we could maybe we could maybe defend in our base. But the special region's gonna be very nice. I don't want Carino to get the wrong idea though, that we're coming for like blood or anything. Cause someday we will, but not yet. Not yet. Alright, processing plant, let's get that. We'll retake that spice field in time once we have a big enough army to defend it. We're ready, Baron. We're ready, Baron. All right. So non-aggression. So now we only have to worry about smuggler aggression for now. It's like a temporary, uh, temporary piece of sorts. All right. Let's get you. Do that. And diplomatic congress. Huh. That's actually not a bad idea. Um, so let's do that on ourselves. Well, we we're, we're already have two packs. So we're going to just put one vote in that to get that. And then the elected enemy military units within the faction's border gives negative influence. So we're going to vote that on ourselves to um, keep people from attacking us while we expand out. So we're going to go grab that again and hope for the best. Um, all right. Let's get a gunner. Our manpower production should be going. Main base is coming along nicely. Gain plus 10 intel whenever we um, kill enemy units. That's really, really good. Alright, so I'm very grateful that he let me have that. Um, unfortunately, though, we're not anywhere near getting our big spaceship, um, which I would love. You don't have enough to do the big scary stuff. Landsrad is going. Let's go do a little pillaging. Shares. Nobody's really buying shares at the moment, so we can probably jump up to 10k uncontested. Okay, so what do we want to get there? One building of each type? No, it's by silos. Okay. All right, pull those back. Oh, somebody's raiding him there. Certainly ain't me. That is for sure. Um, in this region, yeah, let's slap a manpower building down. We're going to want to oppress that eventually, too. I feel like I might be over-oppressing this game, like, too much. I've got too much of a chub for it, you know? 
Could be the case. All right, so we finished that. Let's just go all out on the eco and just hope that it works out for us. If we can get the great convention watchers, then we'll be we'll be sitting a okay. All right, team, looks good, looks good. And all right, so that one's ready to be oppressed. Let's come down here and take this place down. We have the full 10% slurry production. Exchange rates are good. We're mining spice adequately, even with just two. I know, I want the big scary spaceship, but it's like, uh, I'd have to give up either spice or, um, or, or my influence, both of which I don't have an excess of, so it's not really on the tables right now. Okay, so we did get the great convention watchers, and everyone is losing authority right now, which is good. That's going to keep some of the other factions from expanding. Um, Carino's looking pretty chill next to us. And now we're starting, you guys see the Harkonnen wealth engine starting to go? It's like, this is, this is where we can get a little crunk for sure. Um, all right, so research hub's not going to be super good here. Just go ahead and oppress. Just Harkonnen thinks. Water's a little bit tight, so we probably want to get water down here if possible. Um, yeah, missile turret didn't even help that much. We're just going to slap down some water. And now we have a brainwashed agent, which we can do for the toxic vapors. So we're going to sacrifice them for that and get that. So if we get attacked again, we can pop the toxic vapors and uh, calm shit down, basically, is the game plan. Water in this region isn't that good, but we can get some knowledge, maybe, if we want to. Or just some basic Solari. Yeah, the troll troll attacks from everywhere. Main base is looking good. Could get knowledge and hegemony gains here. For you, Baron. And now the water's back online because of the rebellion. And we have another agent. Cool. Um, let's go ahead and go to Arrakis or Landsrad. We should have, with our district being finished now, we should have pretty good. Plus two influence, plus five intel, so that's outstanding. We just need to get that nasty agent operation on where if people keep attacking us, we can just keep spamming the toxic elements on them. Um, all right, so water is coming here. Probably a, yeah, we can get down there relatively quickly. It is kind of far. Um, let's actually delete that and make an airport here. Oh, looks like a rebellion totally screwed up our uh, strategies here. All right, so that's not bad. Let's go ahead and slap a missile turret down here. It's kind of a precarious position. Um, I don't think the smugglers are coming anytime soon. I think they had their fun early and now they're just ecoing, so. Chome shares are really pricey because Carino's buying them right now. They're pushing up the prices. Um, this gives us access to Research Hub. I really should just have an airfield up here. Really, really should have an airfield. All right. So everything is stabilized there. And we want to get an airfield here too, if possible. All right, what's coming up? Judge of the Council, which it looks like a lot of people are actually eligible for. So there's a lot. Yeah, I'm going to get the Chone building. It's, um, it's, it's definitely on the docket. It's going to probably be my next build. Oh, hello. Okay, so they maybe are coming down here. If they try and raid me again, I'm just going to do the toxic vapors on them. And uh, hopefully that'll be enough to shut them down. All right, toxic vapor time. I mean, his whole army is going to take some damage. We're going to lose our militia for sure, but he's going to start losing a handful of units too. Yep. Be gone, spawn of darkness. We can do that all day, dude. We can do it all freaking day. And in the meantime, um, we are just going to get you guys back so you don't die to the toxic vapors, get the heavy militia re-equipped. And we'll see if he wants to keep going at it. I don't know why he's not raiding ECAS. I mean, I guess I, I'm pretty rich, so that makes sense. Yeah, now we have an airfield, so we should be able to jump down there and grab some goodies. And we'll have another Toxic Vapor. Combat Drugs. Um, we have a lot of authority. I would like to grab that Spice Field again, but it ain't going to be easy. Oh, somebody tried to thumper his army. It wasn't me. Okay, Judge of the Council. Let's decline that. Hmm. 
So I'm going to do this. Um, let's do that. Decline judge. Hopefully everybody will decline it. And now our army is growing a little bit. We're going very greedy on the chome stuff, which is always fun. And um, we can get the research building here. I think we can only build one. Let's kind of lurk down here. I love the decoy thumper though, it's pretty fun. Uh, we want to hold on to the intel, but we can do this and sacrifice another brainwashed agent to get the goodies. So we're going to do that for the um, toxic vapors. Yeah, cool. So we can pop that at any time. Throw them hands. <laughs> he says, delete the smuggling building or I'm throwing hands at the smugglers. Oh, I love it. The Hadris is, is making, he's not making friends, that's for sure. Usually smugglers would be homies. They would be like the ones that you'd uh, be buddying up with here. But So we're going to go ahead and delete this and get the big experimental building here, which will sauce our eco. The experimental furnace, and um, aside from that, how are we doing on everything else? I think we're all right. Just throw like a random knowledge building down there. Nuclear. Oh, Ecas is going nukes. Oh my God, he's going nukes, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Ecas is getting ready to party. I love it. Okay, so that's been pillaged. Um, authority. We're gonna just save up for the spice field on the bottom. And. Um, Kill these militia. We can probably fight that smuggler army. It's mostly tier one units. I don't know how scary it'll be at this point, but let's get a couple more of you guys. We can build in the main base. Hmm. Yeah, let's just throw that down there. It's fine. Rebellion's going down all over the lands. It's my favorite thing ever. Spying mastery. And then we probably want to get like the basic matili uh, a military, and then we can go down to get the... Um, the other goodies. How are we doing on selling spice? Yeah, we need to get the spice exchange rate one. This will be free to capture in nine days, so still a while before we can get that. We could go down and get this region. Be very hard to defend though. Um, apparently it looks like he's being attacked here. He doesn't have an airfield. So I could go down there and, and do a little bit of damage actually. Hmm. Let's not risk throwing our army away. I'm very happy with our defensive posture. Let's get to 10% on chairs. Uh, Carino is cackling pretty hard, so we're going to have to, um, Adri's attacking me nonstop, makes me a little bit nervous here. Um, all right, so let's lose some manpower. Let's get our harvesters fully sauced out. So we almost have enough for a mothership. Lose 150 intel, it's fine. We have really good intel income. Hmm. Okay, there's a renegade base up there. I would like to get peace with Hadries. Let's get I don't know if he'll take it. He's been having a really good time raiding me, getting his jollies off. Um, how are we looking there and there? This experimental furnace is going to give us a, a, a pretty good amount of money. Rebels are free real estate, absolutely. I'm going to keep buying shares to keep Carino from going to bananas. I need to get to 10% too, so... Because we're actually playing politics this game. We're not going to be just a fool, as we usually are. This site gives, yeah, it's a really good one. Really, really good one. Maybe we just go get this and hang out, see how that goes down. All right, up you go. Let's cut that and get a missile turret here. We could get attacked at any time. Shares are going up in price, so let's wait till they go down. And if we take this Renegade base down, it's gonna give us, I don't know if we even can, can we? Hmm. Let's take that special region first. How do you eco as Carino? You just build double buildings and take advantage of village traits. That's really if you if you if you're not going with Wensica, you're just playing Carino wrong. She's like she's so good. Some of the there are some counselors in this game that could use some milk for sure. All right, toxic vapors time. In case I get attacked again, I can drop that. And the main base is good. Alrighty, so we're gonna take that. Kind of expanding away from the smugglers pressure. Yeah. 
Carino is going pretty hard on the chum that's right there. So there must be a siege around here somewhere. So we could do a little probe setup and find it. Okay, built, built. Everything is pretty much fully built now. Um, in this region, is it worth oppressing? Not really. Uh, we can just do a very simple eco building there. He's saying he's just going to 30%. That's what they all say. That's what they all say, guys. Yeah, village traits. Because uh, you, you get, like if it says like, oh, this village gives you money for pla plastic buildings. You just spam two plastic buildings because you can build two, right? Which is incredibly strong. All right. All right. I, I kind of feel like just spamming heavy militia to buy time and turret DPS is better than the other ones who just get dove. For you, Baron. Doing governorship is up. Wow. Oh, Ekaz is ready for governor. That's crazy. That is pretty nuts. So we're not nuking this time, obviously. We're, we're being pretty chill in that department. Um, did we check the siege? Oh, it must be in one of these territories. Okay. I have decent political influence. So I should be able to stop them from getting elected governor. Um, it should be very doable for us. Okay, looks fine, looks fine. Ooh, we're out of militia slots here, actually. We need to go down there and, and sauce those militia up. I'm actually legitimately gonna, um, gonna vote that down. Because I'm not in a position to get over there and kill him. Okay, water is down because of the rebels. Pretty, pretty troll. There's the siege, which we could obviously take down if we want to. And we have another agent to sacrifice if need be. Okay, we did discover the siege. Good. Yeah, it's a brainwashed agent. It's really useful. Yeah, so we would obviously do that. All right, so now we're getting some military tech, so we're not going to be a complete idiot. We can actually fight back. Uh, I don't know if we could take that spot. Maybe. We can get water up here, too, which is great. I love that Ekaz, who's like the most politically friendly faction, is building nukes. Yeah, nukes have a great influence in politics. Absolutely. We love it. Nukes are our favorite. All right, so... Let's get that for those bad boys. And um, great. I'm at 10% now, so I should have the basic buffs. You know what? I don't think we can take this Renegade base. I'm going to try, but um, we're going we're gonna to try this out and see how this goes. Ay, ay, ay. These Renegade bases are no joke. My executioners are uh, doing okay, obviously, but... I could use the combat drugs here. Okay, I'm getting spaceship parts. And um, let's go ahead and make some more of these. I think somebody legitimately is using some sort of trolley, trolley tech on me here. Trying to shut me down. All right, so ECAS got denied on governorship. It's too early. None of us are like strong enough to get in there and just bully them, you know? Unassigned. Oh, I just brainwashed a bunch of agents. Okay. So I suspect that there's some counterintelligence stuff going on here. So I'm going to slap the base on that. Make sure all's good in the neighborhood. And looks like the executioners were really stalwart units. Um, we got to deal with that. Oh, shit. Oh, pathing. Why this? All right. So one of our militia... Garrison's has lost. So we're going to get recruitment initiative and then we'll do the um, the stuff to make our militia stronger so they can beat the rebellions easier. Great. So we actually did that. That's really good. That's really good. So we got the water. Let's get a missile turret here and we can dissemble that. It's going to give us enough for our big flagship, which is going to be big old, big old powerful. We're creeping up on shares too. We're at 14%. We want to get 30 ourselves, but it's going to be hard. And uh, let's go ahead and do this. And let's get the ranged upgrades with these guys. The Gatling gun combo is sweet on those guys. I love it. What do you need? We're here for you. Waiting targets. 
Oh, come on. Come on. Oh my god, it couldn't path away. That's pretty annoying. Lands rad standing. Sure, we'll take it. Um, spice fields are looking good. Hadri's coming with a doom stack again. We're ready to we're ready to have fun with him though if he wants. We're ready. Did we clear that base out yet? No, not yet. Okay, let's go do that. We're just gonna use the toxic clouds if he jumps on my base. Try and try and do that. Um, let's take that base for reals. One and one. You guys come south, clear this out, and then we just get the machine gunners and the overlord. He might just be pillaging too, which you know wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. We got to keep on uh, on top of reproducing our militia when they die, though. Now, our main base is vulnerable to damage. I don't think that's like too much of an issue here. Could be, could be. Um, all right. So what do we want to get here? Clean that out. I don't see any smuggler attacks at the moment. You could be going stealth, which would be pretty funny. Um, let's get the militia here. All right. So getting the border defenses tech could be cool. Let's we'll start making friends with this siege. Overlords on the way out. And so it begins. 15% shares, like we're pretty rich. I haven't been missing my, my drops, I don't think. I don't like the smugglers moving down there. It's making me a little bit nervous. All right, so let's assign you to the spice and assign you to the spice as well. Buy this to get some propaganda action going. Okay. So he could be coming for me, I'm not sure. I do have way too many executioners at the moment. A very elite army, to say the least. We'll be sacrificing these guys for the sleeper agent. Not bad. Because that gives me money every time I do that too. And now we can build main base stuff too. Rebellions are being handled. Um, let's get fuel cells. I don't get it. I'm clearing out all... Oh, he's getting assassinated. Okay, Hadris is assassinating old Wookiee. Hadris assassin. <laughs> that makes me feel I should like get on counterintelligence like right now. Um, let's counter that. Let's go straight to countermeasures. Trying to get some intel out of the map. I, I could probably take his army now. Not with just this force though. We would need the mothership too. All right, Carino's assassinating him. Wow, okay. And up here, let's get a military base because that could end up happening here. Um, Hadri's raiding. <laughs> Smugglers. Yeah, so maybe we go to the top. Uh, let's cut you actually and get this. Get some troopers, judge of the council. Do I have enough votes to actually win this? Oh, it's against me and Karina, basically. Okay, well, let's see what we can do. All right. Dang, you found the last one. Oh, Karina was trying to assassinate him, man. That's crazy. It was getting real violent between them two. All right, we're at 16%. Um, we need to rebuild the militia in this base because I have been neglecting to do that. Let's reveal a siege. And then we can restock those guys up. Looking good here, looking good here. How's the water in this region? It's not amazing. Could build the dreaded nuclear nuclear silo. All right. Militia coming out. Wookie says I was sweating. So somebody was trying to assassinate him. As far as hedge goes, we're actually pretty good, but Carino, um, all right, lads. Hadris, you need to uh, stop trolling southern border Carino getting hedge yeah we gotta we gotta deal with Carino now like because they're gonna start getting way too powerful for us and then we're not it's gonna be too late right but set up near mid he can like move up smugs have no penalty he has no penalty for a distance. 
All right, so let's get this siege, which we're already friends with, and this one, which we will work on befriending also. All right, so I'm going to send Pedri's a... Um, did that? Did this one go through? Not yet, okay. Yeah, we're going to see what we can magic we can work here. I don't know if it's going to happen, but... Did I win it? Ah, I got Eye of the Council, sweet. So that means I get a, a couple of free agents. All right, so we'll slap a couple on counter intel and we'll slap some on lands rad. See, we're playing smarter this game. We're not just like throwing our army to the dogs, which is admittedly very fun. But, um, yeah. Wow, oh my God, wait, where did all those guys come from? Do they not get like plugged in? We'll keep those brainwashed agents ready. We got 370. Um, I really want to get that spice field back, but it is kind of like a really contentious spot. Carino needs to be stopped though. They're getting too strong. You see, he's already building double missile turrets. We're just going to go for the weak spots. Uh, can we break that pact? Not yet. We need 100 influence, which is pretty serious. I know. You can stop telling me. I'm aware of it. Countermeasures. We got two on counter intel right now, not one. What does this region do? Ooh, that's really good. Holy shit. Okay. So we need to go down and grab this territory because it gives us 10% um, military power once we ally them. Which is crazy good. Crazy, crazy good. So it's completed. It's completed. Um, this one in the back. We can get an airfield here. Enemy nuclear warhead ready? Who is that? The ECAS with the nukes, dude. Oh man, ECAS nuking. So my concern is if I deal with Carino, I wonder if anybody else is going to help. I could even lose to them. That's the thing. It's like Carino is pretty jacked. So, um, and does he have 30% shares? No, not yet. Okay, we need to buy to keep him from that if possible. Make it a little bit harder. Am I missing my spice taxes? I don't think so, but let's push up a little bit to be safe. Okay, let's take those bad boys down. And we do have enough to break it here in a second. And then we can just fly up there and uh, even over here. Yeah, we got two airfields. He says this is purely a deterrent. I like it. Ooh, 100% annex cost. That feels bad. We'll just wait. We're not like in need of more territory anyways. All right, let's get the overlord over here. And you guys get ready to party. Shit, he's about to get 30% chome shares. That's really bad. It's really, really bad for us. It ain't good. It ain't good. How's the main base looking? I think it's pretty much fully developed just about. Yeah, not quite. We're missing a couple military buildings. All right. So let's break. get out of this in a second. We should have enough. Is it? How much is it? Oh, you can't, you can't break alliances while shuttles are in progress. That's interesting. It's easy to forget. All right. Let's get you guys. Um, how's everything looking? And then we can break this. Somebody, somebody else is going to have to do something, though, or else he's going to cackle and win. Krino's really good at just winning on hedge and just being nasty in general. Holy shit. You guys see that army? I mean, in his territory, I can't win that. But if I'm, like... Yeah, if I'm, like, out and about, maybe, maybe. All right. So probably he's probably privy to assassination attempts. Carino's hedge is closing in on 20. He's closing in on 20k, guys, with dual works. Yeah, this is like the moment where everybody has to turn on Carino or he's going to win. We'll see if the, the Potato Legion can gather its senses and, and do it. Um, who knows? Okay, Overlord's coming this way. Let's go after the Spice Harvesters. We have a lot of um, authority, which we can use at any point. Okay, he's moving over here now. Good. He's spending a lot of money to do that. Every time we run back and forth, he's just he's just going to lose money, which is pretty funny. Loss of rights coming up. Uh, I mean, sure. It's not like... <laughs> he's saying get as I just bounce back and forth between his two bases. All right, I got to catch him somewhere where he doesn't have such an advantage on me. Okay, so he's at 30%. I'm at 18. 
His army is probably stronger than mine. Um, all right, Water Sellers Union. We do not have it, so I am just going to vote for myself on this to p punish anybody who attacks me. Okay, he's trying to get his big flagship here. <laughs> Look at the Benny Hill! Yeah, we need to just keep distracting until... Oh, uh, go Ekaz. I need to go north. We need to 2v1 him, because he's just going to win otherwise. Um, 100%. Okay, so that's going to finish. Then we just go down and get all the military tech. Let's go for this base. That's his second Imperial base there. Is he going to fly north again? Look, look. As soon as he flies north, we just cackle back south. <laughs> That's so troll, dude. Look at him. Look. Let's have our flagships do battle. Um, all right. That's fine. And um, yeah, our flagship should win that fight. Ekaz, you got to help, homie. We're going to just lose to this guy. I'm telling you, this is how I win with Carino. Just haggard cheese. Okay, so let's not trigger the militia. We'll do that on our way. Am I keeping him busy? Is Ekaz doing anything? Well, the flagship duel is pretty funny, I'm not going to lie. It looks like his ship actually is beating up my ship. I assume mine would win. Since his is more of like an airfield type thing. I need someone else to attack because I'm going to lose everything diving in at him. Let's see how rich he is. 8k? Okay, he's about as rich as I am. Let's go kill his harvester if we can. Um, rebellions. Holy shit. Oh, god, that's so bad. I need to go deal with that. Because if we lose that, then that's just like such a big setback for us. Alright, so get you guys down there. Our militia aren't, are not strong enough at the moment. Alright. We need to fly down there like stat. I guess we're going... I, I didn't want to go nuclear Harkonnens again, but... I mean, okay. I think we might need to nukes to kill Carino. Shit, we're going to lose this base. Are they being pillaged or... I have to see what's going on there. If they come after me, I can get them with the, the debuffs and stuff. So we'll just do this. We're here for you. Whichever way he goes, we're fine. All right. That sucks. Um, it looks like he's coming here. We're gonna fly there. It was just a just a, a a a raid. Okay, he just got something eaten by a worm. His forward units. Let's get the two house legionnaires. They're pretty good units. And shuttle up top. Yeah, I really need to capture some territories. Um, maybe we grab you and you and just have you guys go capture some of the peripheral territories in our base. Wouldn't be a bad idea. Just go grab those. All right, are they gonna go? He did get wormed a little bit. Nobody else is attacking him, as far as I can tell. Maybe a little bit of raiding. We're, we gotta wait for our own worming to wear off. Our own worm time. Um, assassinations are on the table too. Could do administrative burden. It's a pretty good one. Oh, I should have sacrificed the brainwash agent. Hold on. Let's cancel that and we go down to the uh, not the sleeper agents. It's kind of ordered very strangely, isn't it? Administrative burden, yes. Can we get in there? There we go, just a little bit of lag. All right, so let's also get that going. Cool. Those guys need to grab that base. So we're just gonna at least spend our, our resources here. Smugglers, uh, I don't know if they're helping. I'm not sure. Maybe they are. Going out, okay. You're, you're on it. I'm a team player here. We're going. No, I'm on it. Roger. All right, so we're moving. Uh, do we have a probe set up somewhere? Let's see how this all looks. And then we can do the worming. And go out for this base. Let's uh, go ahead and capture that. You go here. We're probably going to lose a lot of this army. It's fine. We can just curl under here. Okay, so we we did bait out a little bit of a, a force here. 
What's, what's funny is we can actually pull back now and attack his other base because the worm is going to block him from running to it, potentially. I'm pushing top. All right, great. See, he already captured our agent because it's just like, against Karina, it's so incredibly difficult to uh, assassinate them. All right, let's do this and get some uh, military factory here for the strength. Buy some more shares. Let's head this way. Ecaz claims to be pushing top. I don't know how that's going. Um, nukes will be on the table soon. We just ran out of water. Lovely, right when we attacked. It's my favorite. All right, we'll kill the militia real quick and um, pop sleeper agents so we get free units. All right, let's see this. Take down all these. All right, as long as some eco damage is getting done, then we're we're chilling. That's good. Administrative burden. We did do that. Nice. So he's spamming mercs. We're just gonna pull back. We did we did plenty of damage. And uh, let's go ahead and get some more of you guys and stealth probes. We got some more brainwashed agents to use. So let's go ahead and sacrifice them for the burden. And pull back. All right. So yeah, we killed a couple buildings there. We just gotta keep this pressure on. Um, exchange rates are super good right now. So we're just gonna mass sell spice and see what we can get done. All right, so the space is still building. Let's get them going up here. And we're about to get parallel training slots. It's a really good one. That'll give us extra goodies. Landsrad, Judge of the Council. Um, that one's all right. Let's take the um, non-faction information levels uh, cannot be lower than two. I don't know, can we actually win that? No, we might actually be able to. All right, let's, let's try and get the Judge of the Council. The judge, the judge, jury, and executioners are on the way. All right, so let's go take his Spice Harvester out. Um, other stuff, Sleeper Agents are, is a really, really good buff. All right, hustle, hustle. It's been a good match so far. It's been good, it's very scrappy. All right, that, that'll give us a big military power spike, which we certainly need. So we're gonna try and take his Spice Harvesters to make him miss taxes. That's a, it's a pretty effective tactic actually, it works very well. All right, so we got a Spice Harvester down, let's retreat. Look at all the mercs. That's all he's got. Yeah, that's pretty funny. And then, um, cool. So he's going to start missing spice taxes, probably. Um, let's make sure nothing else in the base is going really bad. Let's just get water here as a contingency. Looks good, looks good, looks good. And we need some basic troopers. Yeah, we definitely do. But manpower, is, is it manpower we're lacking? Oh, it's like the water stuff. Okay. Um, shares, what are we at? We're at 18%. He's at 29. So we have been able to bring him down. Wow, that mass merc army is pretty mean. It is pretty funny for sure. This is Dune Spice Wars. So it's based on the Dune universe. It's super fun. All right. So we got 328. That's coming along. Uh, Intel per statecraft building and military building stuff too. We can prepare nukes at some point. I don't know if it's worth. Hostile units near my territory. Attacking there sucks. This base is more is definitely more vulnerable. He's got the double imperial base here, which is like for me targeting. It's very difficult. Um, I'm gonna try and get a non-aggression with Hadris. Um, let's see if we'll take it. For pathing. Okay. Let's see if Hadrius wants to take it or if he's still going to backstab us in the end. Either one is respectable. He took it. Nice. So we're all in the family now. Let's get some intel going. We could go here in a rebellion once again. So let's just keep going after his spice harvesters. Yeah, look, he's flying here. The fact, the fact that he's able to fly like this probably means Ekaz is not, not chilling. Okay, he's got Sardaukar and stuff. Let's go get that Spice Harvester again. 
main base, we're about to get a nice little timing. 1v2 is rough. Yeah? Well, that's what happens. You're playing the strongest uh, faction. You're going to you're gonna draw the Wrath. That's how you got to bounce it out, right? He pulls the Harvester back. We're going to go for this base here, though. Um, let's do Administrative Burden as soon as we fight here. I'm down to fight this, actually. It's going to be a little bit ugly, but we'll, we'll do our best. Uh-huh. Sleeper Agent. Uh, hopefully Ekaz goes. Uh, go Ekaz. Go Ekaz. The hell are we like actually doing okay here? Is my army not fighting? It's kind of weird. It's like, oh, I guess it's just mostly, mostly, uh, let's run back here. I don't think I did the decoy thumper. All right, so you guys and you guys, let's shuttle you up here. Keep running. We can do the decoy thumper if we want to. Hopefully the overlord can escape. All right. We need Ecast to attack at the same time because I'm just suiciding into his defenses is brutal. Uh, a couple brainwashed agents, nice. All right, so let's get that going. Um, we never were able to get the spying going on him. Toxic Vapors did finish. Um, let's get that, which is defense breaches, and we can get the administrative burden too. All right, so we have all the goodies. Definitely need the machine gun boys now. What do you need? 10 more command points on the way. All right, so there we go. And Landrad judges, probably not gonna be turbo useful. Check our empire, see how it's all hanging together. All right, we're, we're holding on by a thread, ladies and gentlemen, we're holding on. Mm. And let's just get a knowledge building to be slightly faster. Round two, man. Nukes would help, but it would also end my chances of winning politically. Which, I don't know if we're at that point yet of like, you know, no return. Let's build that. Ekaz is going for the Imperial base, wow. Um, Alright, let's do Administrative Burden on him. So he has trouble remaking units. I'm gonna go help out over there, if I can. Alright, so let's get the Mothership. Uh, main base sniping isn't the best way to beat Carino because they can just, they have two bases. I mean, it's still, if it's free, yeah, but. We're here for you. All right, gathering up. Let's get in there and attack. I'm very tempted to nuke. I'm very, very tempted, but again, I'm going to lose the game if I do that. Oh, he's still got a lot of his army there. Yeah, okay. So we're going to go to the top and force him up there. He's going to have trouble remaking units. Keep trying. I will too. Hadri's prob not helping though. I feel like Hadri's isn't helping. <laughs> he's just doing, he's just sitting down there. I don't know if he's helping or not. All right, how's Stamper doing on money? He's very poor. Not yet. I don't want you to lose the game, you know? I want you to have a chance here. All right, so let's uh, throw a brainwashed agent in there. Oh, hello. Decoy Thumper of the Gods. Well played, well played. It's gonna force me back. Maybe I get shy looted too. All right, so let's go to the middle. Take that base down. Here we go, baby, let's get, let's creep. He's just mass um, eco investigation on Carino. Yeah, definitely. Screw the eye of the council. We need to bury Carino right now. Oh man, he's got so many defenses here. It's nasty. I don't know if we can take all these these range units. It's pretty pretty troll. Um, toxic vapors would be okay, I guess. I don't think we're killing much. The militia are definitely obstructing it. And then you dive these guys. Good. All right. So just keep the attrition going. Cerberus executioners. If we could just drain him out, that's what it's all about. Okay, a lot of the range units are dying now, which is good. He's not going to be able to keep doing this. Okay, we just wiped his army. Alright, so let's get out of here with these guys. Refre refresh. Um, administrative burden, so we can't rebuild his army easily. And um, 
All right, unassigned agents, yes. Sure, why not? Let's get you on there. Let's get you on counter intel for now. Um, countermeasures are done. Siege incentives. Oh, we forgot adrenaline addiction. That's very potato of us. All right. So he's hurting now bad. Like, he's got to be... Wow, he still has 5K. That's crazy good. That's crazy, crazy good. So we got the economic investigation on them. So that's going to... Um, he's going to lose 20% of his chum shares. Let's see what we're at now. We're at 21%. Let's keep buying up. We just got a bunch of agents. Oh, nobody voted on the other thing. So I just got Eye of the Council for free. That's pretty funny. All right, counter intel. What do you need? Okay. Let's get some more machine gun boys. Baron. Then we go up here. Hit the main base. The main base is really damaged. So I think we can get there and do some devastating work. Toxic papers are still in the pocket. Uh, we can slap you on. Uh, we'll slap on smugs. What do you need? As fast as we can. Hopefully, Hadrius will eventually help. Understandably, he's just doing some scheming on the side. Um, this siege is friendly. It's pretty good. Baron. The Baron is good at just making expendable ass armies and throwing them to the dogs. It's it's the most apt uh, apt thing ever. All right, so let's just fight in the main base here. He's making like straight up mercs. All right, so we're killing a lot of mercenaries. Let's just move in. Pretty good. He's he's just hemorrhaging money right now. He's just spamming units out. Uh, Nuke is here. Yeah, very good fight for us. Extremely good. Our mothership is doing great. Those smuggler guys, he's just losing units and droves. We'll just keep farming him. And hopefully ECAS arrives here in a second. Um, our main base is alright too, yeah. Go now. Go now! He's literally just spamming these uh, mercenaries out. He's below 28%. I just got to have drained him financially. He's at 500 gold. He's at 500 G. Okay, let's get the Overlord out of here. Prepare for round two of combat. Um, go grab some bases while we're at it. Oh, Hadrius has arrived. Your uh, Carino Hedge. It's OP. Yeah, he's learning. He's learning the hard way that, you know... We, we do recognize the threat, you know. I'll do a defense breach for Hadris. Um, we'll do sleeper agents there too. Look at that, the hero smuggler is coming in the fourth quarter. You see how many people it, t it takes for us to take him down though? Like that wouldn't be the case with other factions. GG, can't 3v1, yeah. I know, Karino's like that, man. You gotta you gotta watch out. Many, many Harkonnens fell dealing with that. Alright, so I have Judge and I, which is pretty good. Um, as far as other actions go, let's go ahead and do the... Um, we can do this again, check this out. So we grab a brainwashed agent. We go down to the um, administrative burden, defense breaches, and it instant completes it, and then we can drop the base on that too. All right, so we'll start working on you. We need to wait for more units. Got some more brainwashed agents to sacrifice. Yes, yes. God, he's still alive, too. It's insane how he's holding on like this. This is just nuts. It's all three of us, and we're barely barely getting it done, too, which is which is craziness. Um, all right, let's grab a brainwashed agent. Sure, let's do that. Get that siege to be our homie. And uh, 
All right, so these guys will fly up as soon as we get all the troopers. Main base, let's get the barracks. Should have done that a long time ago. Let's grab these troops, have them come grab this. Oh, there's four, four guys there, they won't be able to do it. All right, governorship, uh, d decline gov. Decline gov, lads. Let's see if they do it. We can't let it slip under the radar and then have to go all the way across, right? That's gonna be brutal. Yeah, he's still holding, dude. He's still holding out. It's craziness. Um, there's no point there. Let's just get him on counter intel. Um, all right. So they're good. Let's go here for round ten. Um, yeah, the toxic vapors aren't super helpful here, actually. So what do we want to do? Let's get the combat drugs. He's got two Sardaukar. We got a big ass army coming though. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna try and fight the good fight. Keep working it. Farm the Sardaukar. Oh my God! How is he holding on? He's so it's so rich. I thought I was rich, dude. Oh my god. Alright. So let's just take down the main base if we can. Screw it. Screw it. We're just going in on the main base. A couple waves of this and we should be able to kill it. With all our machine gun boys blasting away on it. That's going to cripple them pretty hard. It should. I'm surprised he's still able to afford this pressure, man. This is nuts. All right, so main base is almost toast. Um, governorship, let's deny that. Main base is almost gone. We got some lands rad boys. So we can come back with those in a minute. He's even still holding. Don't stop, lads. He can win this. He can straight up win this, dudes. Yeah, if we, if we don't take our foot off the pedal. I think one more base dive should get it though. Um, all right, so let's go ahead and do this and sacrifice a brainwashed agent. If we have any, we don't. So we're just gonna do it the old fashioned way. I, dude, the fact that he's holding is nuts. All right, I need to, oh shit, I forgot about the lands. <laughs> all right, so let's, uh, let's not miss any more payments. Oh shit, are we gonna be able to stockpile that in time? Ugh, I just got such a, Hard on for the war that I wasn't paying attention. Trying to trying to end this, you know. Baron. All right, let's take this thing down if we can. Take the freebies. Uh, is there any way I can buy some spice laying around? Grab leftover spice. Hey, we can buy some spice here. Any more spice we can buy? Come on, any spice for the old man? Come on. Oh, I'm trying to pay the exchange rate. Yeah, Carino is definitely the strongest faction in my opinion. I've been playing them lately and I just, I feel like it's, it's, uh, I don't even know how he's holding. Like, the, it's taking all three of us with colossal efforts. But that is, that could, in some ways is the downside, right, of Carino is that you're going to have a target on your back. I think I might be able to actually get this. Um, main base, leave order doesn't help too much. Yeah, we want that. Do we have administrative burden? We do not have it at the moment. Yes. We're ready, Baron. All right, we want the full army, the full might of the Harkonnen legions. Um, he's he's cl closing in on 25k. The space IRS is coming for me. They are. I think I'm about to. Okay. Space IRS will be happy though. We just we just we just finally managed to scrounge our our back taxes and uh, make it work. Should have had that thing healing there. Also should be taking bases. Um, let's take these lands, Chad Guard, and have them go grab this. And then everybody else. One, one, and one. He's claiming to be weak, but you know, you saw what happened last game if you leave a Carino player alive. It's like, you just, you just get wrecked. 
All right, Space IRS should be happy now. Um, wait, did it take my guys? I swore I had them going the other way. Well, whatever. It's all good in the neighborhood. Um, Landsrad Sanding, Solari. Research that. Unassigned agents. Let's get them here. And uh, siege incentives would have been nice. We're here for you. you guys ready for round 10? Let's get the toxic gas going to soften them up a little bit. <laughs> Extra evil. All right, let's run this way. So the toxic gas there should punish those guys. Um, we can start killing some of these buildings here. So let's just steamroll these. Get the freebies where, where we can. Alright, kill some of the buildings here. We have to like do some longer term damage. And then we'll go to the main base. I need some money at the moment. Lab oh, labor rights are, are what's crushing us. Okay. If he dies, I actually inherit a ton of chome shares too, I think. Well, not inherit, but you guys get the idea. Okay. Uh, he'll be back in a second, I'm guessing. I don't know if he's actually DC'd or not. All right, let's do this. The problem is he's still... Oh, Hadrius is creeping up on Smuggler Counterplay too. All right, so we should probably do this. Uh, let's go there. Start on that. Uh, Ekaz, you attack uh, smugglers. What do you need? A strategic move. All right, so let's go down to the main base, do some business. Baron. They're both getting a little bit too crazy. Hadries? Anything for you, Baron. We will do it for yes. You. All right, so let's uh, drop this base. Pump the jams there. Um, other stuff here, what do we want to get? Landsrad stuff? Sure, why not? Insider trading, I love it. How's it going on the bottom? All right, so the main base has fallen. Um, let's see. I'm going to just pull back until he gets back in the game. I could have killed that guaranteed, but I don't want to keep taking territory that he could otherwise defend. So we'll pull back. Um, we need to annex some territory of our own. Maybe go to the south and grab like these bases. On our way. But Carino is still probably has the passive hedge. Uh, is he back? Baron. I'm not sure. All right, let's get some of you guys and some of you guys. For you, Baron. The eco is back in business, so let's like get a nice ratio there. For you. He can reconnect though. Is the thing. You know, he can reconnect. We'll do as you no, there's a renegade base there. All right. So we're just going to go grab that, that siege there. Um, special region belonging to the smugglers. Very much on the table. Um, Landsrad, judge of the council. Yes. That would like to be me. Oh, hold on a sec. I definitely want that. Um, and then we will do this for the rest of them. I have a lot of votes right now. Oh, Carino conceded, so he won't be back? Oh, is that what he said in Discord? Okay. So in that case, I'll, I'll just keep hammering his base, because otherwise the AI is going to just run run tyrannical on us. All right, so how are we looking here? Pretty close. It could be nuclear warhead time for the old Baron. Executioner should be able to win that fight. The AI is still generating double hedge, yes, I know. I'm working on it. If the AI wins, then so be it. It's just how it's going to be. You know, it's how it's going to be. What do you need? But I am going to go after the AI pretty... Or whatever the hell this is. I don't know if it's him or the AI, but we're going to go after it here. And, um, cool. Save up some intel, get the toxic vapors in case I get attacked on the other side. Need to at least kill the workshops. Yes, let's get the spice fields down there. That's going to be great. Command point deficit. Oh, hello. Okay. So my units are actually uh, nerfed at the moment because they uh, I have too much command points. We need to get below that or else we're going to take a big penalty to our damage output. All right, great. So now we're good. Let's liberate this. 
Take that down, pull you guys over here. Pull that back, hold position. That's gonna be going to us. The AI even knows how to be annoying with the, uh, I don't know if that is AI or whatever, but. All right, so let's grab you. How much uh, do we have here? Only one lands rad man, okay. Let's get you guys all fired up. Agents go to the spacing guilds and just kind of methodically work through all their territories here. I think I can keep them in check, but Ekaz needs to keep Hadri's in check or else, you know, we're just toast basically. Because Hadri's has been sneaking hegemony in very effectively. All right, so the machine gunners are knocking down the big ship. Um, thankfully, those guys are not going there. Um, let's go ahead and get some executioners. Assassins are there. So all these brainwashed agents are just wild. How many you get? I'll just sacrifice them for the money. Kill it. Kill that thing. Take it offline. Are we hanging in there? Ay, ay, ay. Um, all right, so more agents. Let's go ahead and do them for the administrative burden or defense breach. Did we just get eaten? We might have just gotten eaten by a worm. Nice. Good Shai Halud. Thank you for helping the Emperor. He'd be like the last person you would you would want to help, you know? All right, so Landsrad Whispers will give us some stuff, but we can go and try and get the workshops, although it's probably too late for that. So probably just going full political is better. All right, so we have another uh, Spice Harvester, which is outstanding. Krino's going to lose a base. The AI won't be smart enough to build like double workshops, I don't think. Maybe it will. We'll find out. Um, all right. So machine gunners. Basic troopers. We took that base. Let's go party here. Pull back and heal for a second. And siege is friendly. Oh, did we sacrifice one of the agents from that siege? Yeah, it's fine. Okay, weird. It's like bugging out. Uh, governorship is up. So I'm up for governor, and so are the smugglers. I could probably go snipe the main base of these guys and just steamroll them, but Hadri's is definitely going to be threatening governor. Granted, there are some good angles on his um, empire here, for sure. Um, let's get an airfield here. Pull you back up. AI is still a threat. Ekaz, you doing okay? Make sure to vote down gov. What do you need? I need to stay on the, because the AI cheats. So this AI is gonna potentially be um, cackling, like pretty hard at us. It'll be cheating on hegemony. So if I don't do it, it's if I go after Hadri's, it's gonna sneak a win in. And that, that would feel bad, you know, that would feel bad. All right, so how are we doing on the shares? We're at 23%. I'm just going to gather up the full Dread Legion and go for the main base. So we take this, let's buy that. Let's annex this region next to the base. He's rebuilding that. Stinky AI cheats, I know exactly. Alright, um, decline Gov. Yeah, and decline it with everything we have. These guys going to make it here, how are we looking? Oh, it's such chaos. It's such chaos, dude. My agent got captured that was on Hadri, so he must have some networks or something that can watch those. Um, let's run you up here. All right. Yeah. I don't know if Ekaz is going to have enough to stop Hadri, though. This is a weird... Him leaving put us in a weird situation because it, um, it gives us a cheating AI, which is very scary. And the AI actually built, or the player actually built good defenses before he left. All right, let's get all these going here. All right, let's take down the turrets. Supply drop. Sleeper agents. And we just gotta, we just gotta attrition our way through this, basically. Yeah, no, I think Hadri's wins. The Ekaz guy is uh, not able to handle him. Damn. Because I was going to say, I could probably take this down. But if Ekaz isn't able, maybe I'll get a nuke out of desperation. 
Um, all right, defense breaches. Come on, Ekaz, get it. What are you doing? You got to stop him. I'm handling one threat. Holy shit, look how quick we're melting that base. That's insanity. Oh, wow, but it's going to be too late for sure. Um, I don't know where Hadri's army is or anything, but... Oh my god, Harkonnen DPS is nutty. Hey, cool stuff, cool stuff. Alright, so now we need to stop Hadri's. Oh, how many Chome shares do I get, by the way? Yeah, not as many. Well, I guess it's percentage-based. Is he going to be able to stop him? Governorship is declined. Um, we got to go like right down there and just beeline it. All right, so you guys go here. Um, yeah, we need to get out of that non-aggression pact. Yes. Oh. All right. We got nukes. Ekaz, Ekaz needs to do something. I wiped so many units, but it killed all mine, and he got loads of hedge. Oh, you got loads of hedge. You're saying? Okay, that's cool. Yeah, we'll go try and do something in the mid. He does have a craft workshop there, so we're going to try and kill that. Um, we could just nuke it, which at this point, you know, screw it, all hands on deck, right? But I think Hadrius wins this one. GG. Yeah, it, this is the time for nukes. This is the time for nukes, ladies and gentlemen. Come on. Oh! <laughs> yeah, there's nukes going down. I'm rushing the craft workshop because he's literally like just about to get there. For you, Come on! Carino player quit. So it, I would have gone after Hadri's earlier, but the AI gets free hegemony and shit. It like cheats. So I had to I had to go after it. Yeah, GG. Damn, that screwed us up. Yeah, it was a close game though. Hmm. Stinky AI cheats. So overall it was a fun game. We were pretty economically powerful. But Carino was such a big threat. Hadri's trolling me on the bottom gave Carino a pretty big lead too. That I have to go for him. Yeah, they get they get hegemony from underworlds. Yeah, it's very good. GG well played. Alright, so what we're gonna do. Yeah, we can do one more game. I think one more is fine. Let's see. Ah, it's, it's been a while, actually. We played quite a bit. Uh, GG, well played. Great games. We could do like a small map Thunderdome or something. Yeah, Carino's was the big scary, though. They like required a 3v1. I had to dump 30, 40,000 gold into Carino, dude. He was such a raid boss, and we still barely got him down. Hmm. Very similar level to Chaos and Magic in Commander when somebody leaves. Yeah, absolutely. 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 Yeah, Harkonnen late game military is very good though. Like the DPS and rate at which you can kill buildings is nuts. Absolutely nuts. Uh, one sec, guys. I'll be right back. I'm going to just check with the lady and potentially we'll do one more game. So hang tight. All right, guys, probably going to call it a night. Hands are a little bit tired, but we'll be um, the next Dune thing you'll see will be the tournament. So Saturday night, I'm going to play. I don't know who I'm going to play. Um, I, I kind of am leaning towards Harkonnens because I want to do some nuking strategies and stuff, which would be really funny. But yeah, it's tricky. Play Well, Carino, I, I have played a lot. Carino is what I got my tournament win with. Um, they're... Yeah, they feel stronger than everyone, for sure. But, like, the downside of that being is that everybody might come... If you're in a lobby with good quality players, they will swarm you. So that is... That's what can happen, you know? So, yeah, there's... There's there's some interesting interesting ideas. Harkonnen seems pretty well-rounded. Like, good military pressure, pretty good economy if you play your cards right. Um, Karina was still richer than us. He was still richer. He was a raid boss. Like, I don't know if if Hadrius was able to see or how much he sent in, but we had to send in so much to stop him. Um, who killed the most units? I would be interested to see that summary. Chome shares. So at the end, we had 23, obviously. Smugglers had 25, and then... Um, guys, look at the units killed. Uh, granted, a lot of that is rebels, so that doesn't really count, yeah. Because Harkonnen are bashing rebels nonstop. All right, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed seeing some Harkonnen madness as well as Pwn getting nuked. It was a good time as always. 
Uh, we'll be back tomorrow. No, we won't. Tomorrow we got some important stuff going on, but uh, maybe Saturday or Sunday there will be a stream. I'm not sure, but lots of good times. Uh, probably more Age of Empires. I'll get back to doing some heavy Total War streams once we get some sort of a new, um, like even like a patch, a balance patch or something. Right now it's just that and all of CA just basically sucking in every way. Um, you know, it's kind of, I don't know, yeah, not as exciting. Uh, how good is the Harkonnen guy that makes units faster? Uh, he's, he's not very good. Honestly, in my experience of um, playing Harkonnen, like, let me just show you real quick. The best agents, you have to take Raven. Without him, you're just you're just basically super super weak. Um, but Glosu is really good. He gives you 50 gold every time you kill a rebel. So every time there's a rebellion, you get like 200 gold. It, it's really good. Um, and Peter has been my new favorite. So every time you sacrifice one of your brainwashed agents, it permanently reduces the cost of those missions, which is nuts. So a mission that normally costs like 500 will be down to like, you know, you could reduce it by almost almost like almost full, right? It, it's pretty insane over the course of a long game. So. Yeah, it's really good. Yeah, and Age of Wonders too. Pwn and I will be doing some streams. I'm sure Hadrius will join us. It'll be fun. Um, all right. So that is uh, that is it. Take care of yourselves. See you on the other t other side. Maybe the big space Chungus will come out in the tournament this weekend. I'm kind of leaning towards it. I think it'll be fun. Yes, Eric Cartman of, of Dune is here. And uh, we'll be back. Take care of yourselves. See you around. Adios. Thanks for joining. And uh, hopefully you enjoyed the, the nuclear uh, destruction in the first game.